ba da da ba da da Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I'm bored out of my mind, and I just need, like, to talk through things while I prepare. I have a calculus to exam about 24 hours from now. And I thought, I gotta study. I gotta study. I've got time. So I thought, well, you know what? We can just, uh, learn together. Calculus is boring, but you know what isn't boring? I can answer questions and talk and, like, do other things whilst doing calculus. Obviously, y'all will be able to see the fun numbers that are going to, uh, come out of this. But, uh, yeah, we're not gonna paint today. It's not, sadly, going to be as entertaining as painting, but it, uh... It's there. Da, da, da. Pop, 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 pop. Pop. Yes! Hell yeah. Yup, I'm pulling up the practice exams right now. We're, we're, I'm, I'm excited. I, I shouldn't be excited. I, I genuinely feel like I've got a good handle on this unit. Compared to last unit. But I have to review, like, a few rules and stuff. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> oh, I'm glad we're in the same boat. Uh, I'm just pulling up the stuff right now. I obviously did not like pre-prepare this. E, of course, E. Hello, Gumi. Oh, people are in VC. And, um, the server. Look at them, they're vibing! Alright, old exam problems. Exam two. Alright, let's learn the hospitals rule. Because that's the one thing I don't understand. Like, I know on paper what it is, but I also don't. Which is why we're here! <laughs> Yeah, no, I'm just gonna do math. I'll I'll do like Q and A and stuff too. I just need to like work out stuff and uh, do some learning. And I figured might as well stream it. I've got nothing better to do tonight. I've got no plans. One sec, chat. I'm pulling you up on actual Twitch because uh, I don't know how friendly Streamlabs will be. Pog, yes. 
Oh, that's my voice. Why is it not muted? Okay, there we go. Uh, there we go. <laughs> there we go. Alright, chat. Now I can see my exam and I can see you guys. like mathematics. <laughs> One sec, I'm gonna make a reddit post. Oh hell yeah! You need to do calculus to Megalovania. Forgot to flare the post. Hello! What kind of math requires- All mathematics requires singing. I don't know what you're talking about. Listen, if calculus helps me- er, uh, If singing helps me get through the hell that is calculus too. I will keep singing. I'm sorry. Ba -ba 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 -ba. I also had um, a coffee about 30 minutes ago, if you cannot tell. We really get in a care. We. I don't think it counts if it's Megalovania, does it? Listen. Still waiting for the ketchup. I don't have ketchup on me, and I don't want to ruin my night of mathematics even more with um, torture that is ketchup. I don't think it really counts as a study stream either. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> oh. I'll put on everywhere at the end of time, and then we can all just sink into existential dread. <laughs> I don't even know what Le Hospital's rule is. This French man thought he could do math, and now I'm struggling. Yeah, quality's a little bad. Uh, let me see if I can fix that. One second. Let me go. Because it's really tiny. It's... 
I can't really like <sighs> Can you see it if I if I put it up there? Yeah, theoretically you could. Uh what studies am I in? I am studying um biomedical engineering. I'm in my first year of college. Uh so it's a lot of prerequisite math. If I write in pen, you might be able to see it. A French man who thinks he can do math. <laughs> we all are. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> If I, like... Listen, man, I hate limits with a burning passion because at the start of the semester, I told myself, you know what, it's fine. I can just use integral to calculator.com to do all my homework. And I did that. And so I did fine on the homework. Yeah, you can get my math notes. I don't care. Here, wait. Math note reveal? Math note reveal? One second, let me grab them. Uh, science to art. That's okay. I'm an art minor. So, I get it. But, uh, math is a blue subject. So, the notebook is blue. But, uh, yeah, this is all from Calc 1. I don't know if stream can see it. One second. Okay, you can barely read it. I'm sorry, boys. But, like, it's just... Hi, Gumi. Oh, thank you for the follow, Sarokin. Math is a blue subject. <laughs> what do you mean? Math is either, like, like red because it's evil, or, 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 or blue. I don't know, like... Blue is, um... No, okay, green is science. Science is green. English or math is blue. Uh, history is red. History is red. Like, social studies is a red subject. And this is the hill I die on. Yeah, no! <laughs> no! I don't know what you mean. Math is 100%. History- yes! History is red! Yeah! Exactly! It just- it has that vibe. History is red. Math is yellow. I feel like, like, chemistry is yellow. Red is English? No! Red is not English! No, I don't agree with- No! Red is social studies! <laughs> chemistry is gray? Mm, chemistry is yellow. Mm. Whoops, I opened up Photoshop on my computer. Did not mean to do that. Whoopsie. <laughs> I spat up my water. Chemistry is horrible. I hate chemistry. I took orgo last semester. That was literal pain. I hated it. Science is green. I agree there, because science is green. But, like, once you branch out into, like, the specific sciences, uh, it's, uh, chemistry is yellow. <laughs> Cannot convince me otherwise. But... <laughs> yes, biology is green. Chem is- No! I don't know where you got that opinion jump. No, what color would physics be? I think my physics notebook is green right now. Because it's ecology guy, flower power. <laughs> you right, you right, you right, you right. Um... I think I have notes on the hospitals rule. I don't really remember it. I know I've got to take the derivative and then take the limits of both the numerator and the denominator. But, uh, it's just... I'm going to expose myself for uh, how much I did not pay attention initially in this uh, unit. 
Here it is. Okay, if the limit as x approaches zero, then... Excuse me. <laughs> what did this person do? Yeah, okay, you take the, the limits of the top and the bottom. Or the, the... The derivative of the top and the bottom. So, like, the top, which is x plus 2 to the x over 2 power. <laughs> you underestimate my power jump. We're all struggling. The top and the bottom. Listen, in my defense, in my defense, I could never remember... <laughs> <laughs> you're right, you're right, you're right. But we're we're not gonna talk about that. They they have like actual terms in Yaoi. I forget what they are. I know like one of them's uke. I wanna say I don't know. I don't wanna talk about Yaoi. Um Uh My Discover Weekly is just sad music. Mine too, boys. Hair reveal you are mm. But uh <laughs> Um I forget which one's the numerator and which one's the denominator, so I have to use top and bottom because I don't want to sound like an idiot for um, not memorizing whichever one's the numerator and which one's the denominator. <laughs> like, that's like third grade mathematics. Den I'm sorry. <laughs> Wait, that's so cute. A number is my favorite top. Oh. I feel like I'm watching SQC trying to name it. <laughs> yeah, man, that's just how it goes. Landfill, thank you so much for the follow. Dude, I'm... Let me tell you, like, I have... I have good grades. Like, I go to a... I, I sound like an idiot. I promise you. I... How did I get this scholarship? Luck. Luck. Luck and <laughs> that's probably it. So we have to take the big boy. Is it the derivative or the anti derivative? Yeah, okay, here, wait. It's x plus 2 to the x over 2 power. Can you read it now? It's hard because, like, I'm literally in my college dorm. But I'm just trying to take the take the the I think the derivative of it is that how it works let me let me check something derivative calculator.com I hate limits with a burning passion too I I hate them so <laughs> much all right if if this checks out then yeah it's the derivative if it if it doesn't check out then it's the antiderivative and I will not enjoy taking the antiderivative of something raised to the x over 2 power Uh, nice forgetting to mention if it's, uh, it's to positive infinity. Listen, it's written like that in the problem, so that's how, that's on the department, not me. <laughs> I swear, our, my school's math department, for as, like, hoity-toity as it is, they don't have their things together. It's it's kind of funny. You can listen to Miku. Hell yeah. Blaming the department. Nice mentality. <laughs> That's how it goes. Okay. <laughs> 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 
press X to doubt. No! Boys, I'm sorry. Listen, man. We're just... It is, it is the derivative. That's good. Which means we just multiply by X over 2. Just Maddie things. You know it. That's how it goes, jump. Oh man, you should have seen me taking Orgo. It was like pulling like I got the class is so bad. No, I know I don't need a derivative here, but it's using Le Hospital's rule to um prove the limit. Cause the the limit as X approaches infinity will just be I think zero, right? Because X is in the, the bottom. I did not take calculus in high school, and it really shows. Limit is one. How did you figure that out so quickly? I mean, good for you. I don't even know what the hell a homographic function is. Wait, Google. Google. What's a homographic? You're using words I haven't heard, man. Okay, yeah. It brought me to... Why is it getting more views than my normal streams? I don't know! Listen. We here aren't gamers today. Today we are we are academics. Yeah, because that seems way too complicated of a derivative. I just looked it up. <laughs> oh, I can simplify it. It's absolutely trivial. Yeah. But that's like literally the way this my school runs their mathematics. Because that's what you gotta do for the stupid rule that I have to learn for my stupid exam. You have to find the linear linear approximation for the numerator and the denominator, and then um, give the ratio of both of those limits, and that'll tell you the limit of the other one. It's very stinky. You know what? We'll move on. We'll take we'll take an actual just practice exam. I'll. Learn the rule tomorrow, I guess. Okay, 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 okay. I really like the problems on like calculating work because it overlaps with my physics class right now, which is pretty epic. So I know what they're talking about there. 
And I have the notes for my last exam, or my last practice exam I took last night. Mm, let's do, let's do this one. Winter 2018 exam. Oh, that's so tiny. Oh, I just meant, I just zoomed in on chat. Whoopsie. Uh, equals one plus two over X, considering the X belongs to... Huh? I'm see you're you're speaking in math I'm not familiar with, which is fascinating. Yeah, two over x the limit is zero. One limit is one. Oh. Da, 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 da. And the composed school with the impressive square. Okay, I get that. I think. Da, 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 da. Well, we're gonna cover my favorite thing, and this is unironically, I love sequences, so we'll go on that. The limits of sums of sequences. When you forget to breathe, what if someone redeems change games? Do you have 12,000 channel points? Square root of a function, which is limited. Okay, yeah. That makes sense. If someone redeems change game, I'm just... I, I'll redeem it again, and then we don't. Because I'm not gaming tonight. Sorry, boys. <laughs> Redeem? No! Gumi, I know you have 8,000 points. We could turn this into a Spanish math stream. And then I use words I have no idea how- I, I know the numbers, but I don't know how to say, like, limit or multiply or... I think Anya Deer is add. It, it is a waste of points today. Or we just refund you. He'll take a refund. Okay, that's fair. <laughs> Considering I'm French and I don't know shit about English math vocabulary, that's okay. That's okay. We're all just here to have a good, good old time together. <laughs> But I guess I can help you if it's only about limits. It's essentially like this unit is uh, limits of sums of sequences, sequences in general, and then um, figuring out whether a sequence's sum converges or diverges based upon um, the properties of the limit it has, if that makes sense. So like, let me find an example. Oh, this is my physics work. You don't want to see that. This is still physics. Physics doesn't end. Okay, so like... We have the sequence... Cosine of pi... Of n. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like that wouldn't converge because it never approaches a limit. Uh, yeah. Oh, physics is disgusting. Let me show you my physics notes because those are so much more well organized and just math everywhere. Physics reveal. I love my physics class. Honestly, we're studying gravity in space right now and it's so much fun. 
which sounds so dorky, but like all my physics work is here. Ignore my shit handwriting. But yeah, it's lots of um circular motion, uh inertia. We're doing a lot with inertia right now. Uh, I've got like just a, I'm like one of those people that like writes their notes in obnoxious pen colors. So like that right there, you can't you can't even see it that well. <laughs> you can't even see it that well on stream. But um it's like this obnoxious bright green color. I hate physics too. Uh I hate chemistry less than I hate physics, but I don't know if you've taken taken orgo at all. If if you know what I'm talking about when I say organic chemistry and the literal hell that's associated with I did mechanics and motions. It's such a pain. Great choice of colors. Uh, you spelled colors wrong, jump. Uh. It's okay. I make fun of him because he's not American and I am. Uh. Organic chemistry is absolute shit. It sucks so badly. I, I hated it. I hated it so much taking it, um, last semester. Sociology. Sociology. Sociology is kind of fun. I did I did AP Psych in, in high school and I loved it. But like I have such a weird I think fixation for that. I've always done much better. Don't tell me what to do, jump. I don't spell it wrong. What do you mean? You fool. I I love biology so much. Biology is my favorite subject. And I like math. I just wish I understood it better. <laughs> what I'm confused is, so we have the sum A of N is equal to 4. I like English too. I don't mind writing uh, at all. And I always liked studying foreign language too. I took Spanish for like 10 years. Da, da, da. The limit of A sub N as N approaches positive infinity somehow equals zero, given that, that we know the sum is equal to four. And so that's where I'm confused that they were able to derive that the sum is zero, or that, that the limit... It's just your German for eight years and now I can't afford <laughs> It's okay. I'm I'm kinda the same way. Like I took Spanish for so long, but I still um don't know it that well. And um according to Gumi, I have a very bad like American accent when I speak Spanish. Which is kinda funny. Four years of English and my level of German is nowhere near my level in English. Well, I think, too, like, you have more opportunity to practice English than you do German. Like, hence right now, you're interacting with me in English versus, I mean, I don't speak German. I know there are people on Twitch that, like, even I follow that have, like, German exclusive streams and I don't understand what's going on. But, like, I think watching a streamer... <sighs> you know what? I got an idea. I don't know if it's illegal to share this, but it is kind of like public information. So, I should be good. Let me share my browser tab. You sound whiter than a, than white when you speak Spanish. I know I do. Uh, I think this is Chrome. I know, I'm... Well, maybe, Gumi, it is because I am white. Let me see if I can share Chrome. Or will I just accidentally put Twitch chat on the screen? That's what we're here to figure out. See, because that's like nice mess. It's not 3 a.m. It's not three. It's not 3 a.m. It's only it's only nine o'clock. It's only nine o'clock, boys. It's only nine here. Eastern time, gang. Woohoo. I'm trying to figure out if I can put Chrome on the screen. So then you can just see the problem. Oh god, no, I don't want to send. 
It's 3 a.m. Oh, God. It's 8. <laughs> oh, God. So glad you're you're here to, to learn math with me instead of sleeping. You really... Big win there, man. I'm not playing a scary game. Although, to be fair, uh, math is a scary thing. Hi, Puffy. Welcome to the stream. Math's, math test is 24 hours from now. Or less than 24. 23 and a half hours from now. Alright, well, I figured out the problem with trying to share Chrome. I believe it's because math is a scary game. It's playing me like a fiddle, man. Okay, that's Twitch chat. There we go. Uh, uh, Alright, a real dilemma question. Probably harder than any math. Best boy from Oran- Ooh. Ooh, that's a tricky question. I, like, when I first watched Oran, was like, I, I liked Kyoya the most. Oh, that's the wrong thing. That's the camera. I liked Kyoya a lot, uh, cause he's like the uh, the silent type. But why does it sound like Osu fail music? Um, can I crop this? Is there a way to do that? There's a way to do that, but I do not know. Honey is such a good character too. I do like Honey. I also just don't want to like expose my school. Let's just uh. Properties. Uh, I don't know how to do this math. I'm in fifth grade. Oh. You have no taste. I'll have to leave. Okay. Okay, no. Who's your favorite boy from Oran, then? That's the real question. Um. Uh... So that's the problem. I don't know how good the quality is. But, yeah. And Puffy, that's okay. We're here to just chat while I... Oh, Tamaki. Tamaki. Okay, yeah. Tamaki's a valid response, though, because, like, oh, he's so good. Yeah. I do like Tamaki, especially towards the end, because it just, like... I think at first he comes across as, like, very arrogant and whatever else, but... I love uh, the relationship he has with Haruhi so much. You haven't watched Oran? Dude, Oran High School Host Club is so good. It's so good. I watched it all in like one sitting. I got like sick uh, like a couple summers ago and I'm like, hmm, what to watch, what to watch, what to watch while I'm like dying. <laughs> and I chose Oran and oh, it was, it was so good. It's very early 2000s, though. Do not talk about High School DxD. Tamaki and My Hero is adorable. Yeah, I like Tamaki and My Hero, too. He's got a cool power. I think he's my favorite of the big three. Fujoshi Show. No, I don't want to talk about that. <laughs> Listen, man, you can pull up my anime list and judge my taste all you want. I'll, I will say, for some context, my first anime was Black Butler, if that tells you at all how I started watching anime. Um... Yeah, I won't comment any further than that. It was recommended to me. It was like right at the time though when um Okay, here. I'll I'll link it. An animal Oh, that's cute. 
No, Gumi, I don't know what you're talking about. High School DxD is like... <sighs> Here, I'll put it in chat. There you go. Sea Dog V. No, I see. I love Sea Dog because, like, I do watch his content, but I didn't watch it back in the day. I love, honestly, Joey is probably my favorite of like Giga Sea Dog and and uh, the Anime Man. I've been watching. I, I watch most of of Joey's content these, day, these days because he gives me recommendations. Also, not to flex, but Ditus is following me on my anime list, and that's the only thing I have to brag about. Da -da -da -da. You've got to go. Good luck on your math exam. Thank you so much. I'm going to need it. I guess, though, as AN gets bigger, it's... How what? <laughs> Jokes on you, I don't know him. Ditus is following me. Yeah, he is. He is. He linked his uh, my anime list on Twitter um, for like a video that the anime man was doing, and uh, and I skipped it like it's nothing. <laughs> <laughs> I love Ditus so much, but uh. Yeah, he, he followed back a lot of people that followed him when he initially linked his, his mail on Twitter. And I was just one of the lucky folks. Yeah, he's a really genuine guy. I've never met him, but I'd love to talk to him one day. He and I have very similar opinions on romance anime. YouTube broke. Oh, it's like, video pause, continue watching. It's like Netflix. I'm just sitting here. I need some idle music. Sir YouTube. Yeah, it, it's kind of broken. I don't know what's wrong with the HTML formatting. Yeah, I have an Annie list account if that actually helps. Holy guacamole! Thank you for the sub, Saren. I appreciate it. Very pog. My only thing is my Annie list account isn't as updated as my Mal account. Also, we love a Twitch Prime. We love a Twitch Prime. You can add stuff. Oh, yeah. It must have just gone through. What's up with the latency? We love using Bezos' money. Oh, no. It's okay. That's good. That's good. That's good. Imagine it delaying until I hopped into the computer. That's funny. I know, Mr. Bezos still hasn't given me my first Twitch paycheck, and I'm kind of salty about it. But you know what? That's okay, Mr. Bezos. You can keep my money. I'll just put off buying a PC. Okay, Monogatari didn't make me cry, but Anohana did. If it makes me cry, it automatically gets a, a boosted score. Okay, but I think it's only Bakke. I think Kizu, Kizu has a higher score than Bakke because I liked Kizu a lot more. Is that a hot take? <laughs> you know, making people cry is easy. It takes a lot to get an anime to make me cry. Like I didn't. I've seen Bungo Stray Dogs. And I'll be honest, Saren, I didn't really like it. I gave it a 5 out of 10, and then I've just refused to watch the second season, because the first season just... It felt like it was trying to be too shonen-y. 
Like, it, the characters and their powers are interesting, but it just... I don't know if it was executed the best. <laughs> Is that a hot take? People on Tumblr, people on Tumblr got so mad at me. Because I'm like, yeah, Bungo Stray Dogs is like a 5 out of 10 anime. Which to me is like, pretty average. E. Oh, you mean the show with the first... And they should... E exactly. Exactly. A? 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 How is another? You rated it a one? Okay, in my defense, in my defense, I watched it when I was 15, and it was like one of the first horror anime I watched. So it kind of serves as a baseline. No. Okay, I argue that Tokyo Ghoul, Tokyo Ghoul is worse than another. I hated. Please don't kill my pets. Please don't kill my pets. That's not very nice. No, I'd argue that Tokyo Ghoul. Like, it just... Mm. I'm not that edgy, I just promise. Don't let the fact that I'm, I am I have black painted nails and I'm wearing a grey sweatshirt tell you otherwise. I'm not that edgy. I cried watching Toradora. I promise you I'm not that edgy. <laughs> Listen, man, I watched Bloom Into You too. I, I, I give the girls a chance too. Yeah, sweater pog. <sighs> what did you rate as ten out of ten? That's intriguing. Oh, Dokusei! Yeah, god, I liked that one. That was good. I watched that not too long ago. Dokusei is really good. It was, yeah. Honestly, it was. It was really pretty, too. I liked the style. It felt very genuine. Because a lot of times... With the shows that like have that as their main focus, it feels... Listen, I was 15 when I started My Hero Academia. You don't... You don't judge the anime opinions of a 15-year-old girl who'd at that point only ever seen Full Metal Alchemist, Your Lie in April, SAO. Like, literally, I think My Hero, for me, represents the turning point when I went from, like, casual anime watcher to, like, most of my Netflix watch history is anime. It went from, like, normal television to, like, weeb shit that whole year. Because literally, like, right after I watched my hero and was like waiting for like season three or something i like started bake and uh, i got recommendations from people on reddit dude that was the longest most boring movie i had to sit through it was so bad <laughs> is the wife who's <laughs> don't say that if they're children <gasps> Yeah, yeah, no, Gumi. <laughs> okay, you say it's seven. Yeah, I mean, it was good, but like... Okay, to be fair, this is like coming off... Of we are friends. Listen, man. We are, we are. But, uh... This is coming off of watching Clan Ad After Story. Like, there are just some anime that I've rated at 10 for, like, the significance they hold in my life. Like, I'll admit Death Note isn't that good. Death Note isn't that good. The first half is, like, 
mm, beautiful chef's kiss. But like, that was like the third anime I ever watched. And it was so damn good to like a 13 year old who had no other opinions on anime. Like, mm, Death Note mm, may or may not have had a crush on Light. May or may not have had a crush on Light. Is that a hot take? Like, Mr. <laughs> Mr. Light, you got me. He, he was the blueprint for, like, the kind of men I enjoy. A little crazy. Fully cool at a seven. <laughs> oh. uh, Fully cool is a little big brain for me, man. Vampire Knight? Ooh, I have not watched that one. I know it's, a, a like, a classic. Like, an older classic. But I haven't watched it. Pew! Oh, dude, auto mod flagged you for that, man. But, uh. Yeah, uh. I don't know. I watched it with a friend, because it's like his favorite anime ever. And, like, I understand why, because I think it's, it's a metaphor for adolescence. If you, like, look at, like, the Reddit threads about it and whatever else. Uh. Yeah, and I really like it, because I enjoy, like,. I don't enjoy Studio Trigger in their storytelling, but I love what Studio Trigger has to offer in terms of animation. It's absolutely wonderful. Like, I hated Promare. I thought Promare was dog shit, but the animation from Promare was just beautiful. And I don't understand why, like, everyone on the internet is like, Studio Trigger's like the second coming of Christ. Yeah, yeah. Gainax, yeah. It wasn't <sighs> Gynex what became part of Studio Trigger? How old is Fooly Cooly? Two thousand. Yeah. So this is this is before Girl and Logan. Two thousand seven. Yeah. Okay. That's what I thought. Excuse me. Do 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 do. I'm just not I'm nitpicking. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> Die right now or live forever? Live forever. Because then I can, like, just correct people's Wikipedia articles. Like, you could make a YouTube career out of that. That's a guilty pleasure, not gonna lie. I've never seen Gurren Lagann. Yeah, bored weird question time. This is tagged AMA, so... I'm here. I'm just sitting, me, my numbers, and chat. We're having a grand old time. Dog song kinda goes hard, not gonna lie. da 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 <laughs> hmm, what's a guilty play? Same vibes as Premiere. Yeah, but I feel like for Premiere, it's like. Like, Studio Trigger, I've made this point before to, like, my friends. Like, Studio Trigger, in the way it tells its stories, is, like, when John Green writes a novel. Because, like, the first time John Green writes a novel, like, Looking for Alaska, was so damn good. But then you compare it to something like Paper Towns, or something that he wrote several years later, and you look at it, and you're like, wow, Paper Towns is just the same story as Looking for Alaska except a little bit of a different execution. And I would argue, Hayloft slaps. Miku Hayloft, even better. But, like, I would argue that, like, like, Studio Trigger's Gurren Logan, or even something like... Yeah, no, I'll argue, like, Kill a Kill, even. Because I've seen, I've seen Kill a Kill, and, uh, BNA, and Promare. Those are, like, the three, and Space Patrol Luluco, but Space Patrol is, like, 
kind of satire. But, uh, biggest guilty pleasure for me, Kyoto Animation. Kyoto Animation is so fucking good. I agree. Mmm. Mmm. Yes, I've heard Beyond the Boundary is really good. That's on my, like, secret plan to watch list. I want to watch it with a friend. But, uh, God. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Satsuki. <sighs> <laughs> yeah, I like Mako from Kill a Kill, but, um, back to my point of Studio Trigger, like, it just feels like the same recycled plot, where, like, big bad corporation is bad guy, and they've got to, like, bound together, and there's always, like, a twist villain, but, like, you saw it coming from, like, a mile away. I love, love, love Kyoto animation, though. I've seen pretty much... No, you leave Mako alone! She's just supportive of her friend! No, I love Mako! She's a sweetheart! She is annoying, but she's a sweetheart! I like Rukio too, just because she's got an awesome character design. That's what I've heard! That's what I've heard. I've heard it's sad, too. And I'm like such... um. Like, sad anime is just such a, a guilty pleasure for me. You're gonna listen to Gumi? Gumi, you're gonna listen to Gumi? How narcissistic. Hell yeah, Pog. Gumi does slap. Gumi was the first Vocaloid I ever listened to. Uh, Echo was my favorite song because I was 13 years old and just edgier than, uh, I don't know, Spikes. Which is hilarious. And I, I have a bit of a resurgence in my Vocaloid phase this summer. Like, I got into, like, making Utao. Yeah, I didn't really like it. It felt so, um... Oh, I don't know how to describe it. Because it, it, it wasn't bad, but it wasn't, like remarkable either like it's when you've seen like really good shoujo all other shoujo just kind of pales in comparison like i really liked maid sama but it wasn't like that good and i i i don't know because like monthly girls nozaki kun or harimia are probably my favorite romance i wouldn't would you classify harimia as shoujo i don't i don't think so but I definitely would classify Monthly Girls Nozaki-kun as shoujo. And like, that one's really, really good. Because it challenges it. <laughs> Why is the third movie of Kizu? I always justify it because it was the last one and I'm mad that it was over. No, uh... Uh, Hanekawa is my favorite Monogatari girl. It makes no sense. Listen. I love Kizu so much, though. I, I really do. I really do. <laughs> I don't have shit taste. <laughs> Hanekawa said no. Okay, okay. Who is your favorite Monogatari girl? And if you say, fucking, what's her face, Shinobu, I'll, I'll cry. I'll literally cry. Shinobu or Sengoku? Sanjo Gohara is so much better. She is a great match for Araragi, but, like, personally, like, I obviously think that Sanjo Gohara and Araragi should be together. Obviously. But, like, personally, I related to Harukawa, so, like, I just projected... Oh, mm. Plus, like, there's that one scene in Kizu, and I'm like, okay, okay, okay. But, 
I don't know. I just, I like her. I only have three waifus. That's valid. <laughs> they are together. Yeah, yeah. I know, I know. Okay, listen. It's been a hot minute since I've watched the Monogatari series. I've been meaning to get through the second season, and I just haven't. Since the beginning of Akira. Yeah. They had that really cute scene under the stars. And that was like, God. That was beautiful. God, I love the ending to Bake so much. And Spotify called me out. It was... So, like, you know the 2020 recap, and it has, like, your most played songs of, of 2020, and I had fucking, fucking Kimi no Shirenai Monogatari as my number one with over a hundred plays. I started listening to it on January, like, 2nd, and then it was like, yeah, and your most plays was, like, fucking 25 on January 3rd, and I'm like, wow, I just found this song and never stopped listening to it. I don't speak, like, any Japanese. <laughs> what does that mean by gooey? <laughs> we are studying. We're also just talking about anime. I do have a silent voice as nine. Listen, man, I went into that very, very blind before like it got all the hype it had from like TikTok and stuff. Listen, man, I'm, I'm a little bit of a hopeless romantic. Can't I live vicariously through my anime? I forgot to say ooh at the end of my- No, I'm not fucking doing that. There will be new- No ooh-woos from me. I'll make it a sub goal. If we hit 25 subs, then I'll do an entire stream in ooh-woo speak. And that'll be literal hell. I'll have to raise my voice an octave. No. I'm broke, sorry. I can only- Oh! Jeez, it startled me. Thank you for the follow. <laughs> That's fine. You don't need to sub, man. I just like entertaining people. Talking about anime. And my apparent shit taste. It's okay, Reddit agrees with you. I'm a Yuki. Why don't I remember what that one is? M to your taste, hell yeah. You shall sell your soul, BRB. Oh god. Gumi, what are you doing? I'm a Yuki. Wait, let me pull up my animes. I don't even remember half the shit I've seen. <laughs> Oh yeah, Jujutsu Kaisen ended. I've got to finish that. I like stopped watching it. Dude, Perfect Blue was so good. I watched it at like 3 in the morning. Do not recommend. You will be traumatized. But like, god, it was so good. Oh. Oh, Charmander. Buddy. He fell. <laughs> Poor Charmander. You all just watched me hurt this man. Yeah, Perfect Blue was revolutionary for me, man. It it messed with me. I did not see the ending coming. Coming. Granted, the foreshadowing was there, but I oh oh, it was so good at subverting expectations.
I don't know. I think, too, like, as I've gotten to watch more anime, I've become a little bit more critical of some of the stuff I've seen. But, I don't know, because, like... <sighs> Obviously, my taste is very... a little generic. But, at the same time, like... I don't know. My favorite thing to debate with people is I gave Fire Force a 5 out of 10, and people really don't like when I say that. Because they'll be like, Fire Force is not a 5 out of 10. Oh, whatever. Whatever. Okay, I like the, like, sappy stuff. It might be generic, but, like, that's okay. Do, 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 do. No, I've been on a bit of a horror kick. Read through my list? Oh, did you now? Seems fine to me. Oh, thank you. What do you rate it out of 10? Fire Force is a 0 out of 10. Fire Force is not that good. It's obviously, like, kind of shitty. Like, like I didn't like it, because, like, especially towards the end... Yeah, yeah, I agree. And and David Productions does a wonderful job with animation. They, like, did this stuff for Cells at Work. Obviously, they do JoJo. But, like, the animation was great, and I think it had so much potential. But, like, especially towards the end, it just felt like they just shoehorned as many science-y words in there as they possibly could. And it just... <laughs> Listen, man, do you like the cat girl? <laughs> they just shoehorned as many science-y words as they could to try to, like, BS an explanation. But, like, as someone who, like, studies science, it's like, what the hell? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you do like the cat girl. Gumi, I knew it. Wait, hold on. What? What is it? Meguka. What do you mean? Madoka? I don't know. I felt like, if you are talking about Madoka, like, um, it's not, the, it's, okay, yeah, I get slandered for that a lot, because, like, lots of people are like, but it was revolutionary for, like, magical girl anime. I do agree, like, it's really creative. Do not get me wrong. And it's, it's ironic, because I gave Wonder Egg a higher score. Madoka is great, but, like, the only action that happened for it and for me was, like, the last four episodes. And that was really disappointing because, like... Okay, I had been under the assumption that it was, like, just gonna be great the whole time. And it was really, really hard to get into because, like, the first, like, six episodes felt really, really slow. I guess. Because I knew, like, there was a twist because, obviously, there was, like, QB and whatever. It, yeah, Wonder Egg does feel a lot like Madoka. But I think it's just the art is better. Is that a hot take? Probably. Like, the art style is very reminiscent of, like, um... Like, something your name would use. But, like... Um, I don't know. It's edgier. Madoka's pretty edgy, too. No, it's not. I guess, I guess. Thriller drama with action elements. I guess. I just... <sighs> it was very hyped up for me, and it didn't live up to that hype. Because it was, like, the, the all-time favorite anime of, like, someone I, like, really, really like. And I'm like, okay, yeah, I'll watch this for them. And I watched it, and I was really, really, like, disappointed about it. I think, like, the stuff with, like, the time travel and whatever else was, like, really smart. I loved the way that was played out. But I just, I couldn't invest myself as much into it as she could, I guess. It was censored, so you're fine. Oh, you're good, you're good, you're good. You're good.
I don't know, like I said, I, like, didn't mind it, but, like, I think especially, like, if I, if I read a little bit more about it and then rewatched it, I think it would have a higher rewatch value. Because I understand, like, what it, what it represents in terms of, like, revolutionizing magical girl anime. Because obviously you can't compare it to something like Sailor Moon. You could, but that'd be quite a spicy take. How could you sit through a movie like that? Hot take. Hot take. Grave of the Fireflies wasn't that good. It pissed me off. Yeah. Like, I like Studio Ghibli. I, I Honestly, I haven't seen, like, the classics, because it's not something I, like, grew up watching. But... I don't know. Like, I've seen some of the classics. Like, I have finally watched Howl's Moving Castle this year. And, like, Princess Mononoke and stuff, and that was really good. But, like, uh, I haven't seen Spirited Away, which... Which is funny, because I've seen like pretty much every other classic Ghibli film except Spirited Away. Uh, keep it- Yeah, it does. It does, it does, it does, it does, it does. Like, I just- I guess it was very frustrating. Because like, I felt like a lot could have been solved if the main character had swallowed his pride. But I also, at the same time, I understand why he wouldn't. So, like, there's that, like, duality that it was building off of, and it was a little frustrating to just watch that unfold, I think. Why is the limit of B as B approaches affinity of two arc tangent... I spelled arc wrong. Arc tangent of B. Why is that 2 pi? Fuyu Mizaki is the one where he, where he didn't do a Ghibli. Oh! I'll have to check that one out. Limit of Arctan. Socratic.org. Let's see. You're a mechanical engineer? That's kind of epic. Yeah, let me pull up Chrome again. You're gonna hate how many tabs I have open. It'll make you physically ill. Give me just a second. Yeah, I'm not studying to be a mechanical engineer, but I am studying to be a biomedical engineer. Which is funny, because it seems like I'm struggling a lot right now, but I, I assure you I'm not. That's the Undertale screen. You don't need to see the fact that I googled the Undertale music to find it. Da, 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 da. Those are the answers. But, okay. Let me full screen this for you guys. Wee! Me and the boys doing math homework. So, like, obviously, the answer derivative of this is two arc tangent of, of x. Two arc tangent x. <laughs> Calculating skull is designed to destroy you. Oh. Of course there is Arctan. There always is. We love Arctan, boys. <laughs> Two times the dirt. Yeah, 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 yeah. Not even. Those are weak maths. Listen, mister, you probably took like Calc 3 or some shit. And you're like, ooh, I am. And you had French math, which seems way more complicated than us, us 
us us Americans and our calculus too. But yeah, that's the problem. I guess I'm just confused because I don't know why the limit. Because like to calculate this, you take, you replace the infinity with a variable, and and you make that variable b, right? And so you take the integral of two arctangent b minus two arctangent zero. And somehow the limit as b approaches infinity of two arctangent b is pi over two. And I don't know why. Like, where did where did the pi over two come from? Here, let me. Very condensed university just after high school. Oh, one of the things they don't tell you is just remember. <laughs> really? Yeah, I hate trig. Trig functions are okay, but like, this seems absolutely trivial. To be fair, like the way my it's cram school, okay. The way my university teaches calculus is very backwards. Like, Calc 2 at my university... Here, I'll go back to my... Calc 2 at my university is notoriously, like, the class that has the highest drop rate next to, like, Physics 240, which is, like, Physics 2. Uh, <laughs> if that tells you anything about how they teach it. Like, the average on this exam that I'm going to take on Monday is literally like um notoriously like in the 50s 50s out of 100 points because it's taught so backwardsly backwardsly what did i talk about trig functions what about them i learned them in high school oh shoot it's anime watch night with my band Sorry. Whoopsie. They probably know I'm streaming. They can see me on Discord. Whoops. <laughs> I feel kind of bad. There's a trick usually about integrals with trigonometry. Really? Yeah. Like, obviously, I'm not a math expert. Don't worry about anime watch night. School's more important. Oh. <laughs> That's true. We were gonna watch, um, Heaven's Design Property, though, and it's really interesting. I like it. It's fun. We're substituting tan pi over 2 Oh. Look at the- Oh, okay. I know who you are. <laughs> <laughs> Hi. <laughs> I didn't know you had a Twitch account. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> yeah, I'm here. I'm doing math. <laughs> I hate 116 so much. <laughs> Oh, for some context, the other user in chat is someone I know in, in real life. Yeah, Math116 is, is evil. But we're getting through it, we're getting through it, we're getting through it, we're getting through it. Yeah, no worries. Oh, that means you were here to hear all my spicy takes about anime. <laughs> Which is fair. I have a lot of bad opinions, but that's okay. Listen, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh no! I'll give it a rewatch or something. Aren't there movies? I could watch one of those. Yeah, so it's just a general rule. Oh, 
hello, Wayne. <laughs> I like how your ass had to be permitted by the auto mod. <laughs> Find something that meets my taste after heaven's done. That's okay. I, I like literally anything. I'm down to watch whatever. I actually don't know. I Ooh. Mmm. Disappearance of heart. Yeah, do I need to watch... Uh... I've heard a lot about it. I've heard a lot about it. And Kyoto Animation. Kyoto Animation did Haruhi Suzumiya. So I know I'll like it because I love Kyoto. Oh, Mr. Wayne, I, I don't know your reference. I'm sorry. I am a zoomer. I do need to watch this series. Isn't it like super long though? I'm secretly, it's not on my anime list because I've just, I've neglected to watch it. Uh, fucking Fruits Basket? Uh, but the, the 2019 remake. I don't know if that's like a bad thing. Like, I don't mind Fruits Basket, it's not that bad. I wanted to know what the hype was. Da, da, da. Oh, you're really gonna just stop? School of Rock? I have never seen School of Rock. You will learn. If you like Kyoto anime, Hibiki Euphorium. Ooh, yeah. Yeah, let's watch that. School of Rock? I, I haven't seen a lot of, like, popular movies. It is a requirement because our are <laughs> All Alright. Dude, they did cut it off right in the middle of Battle of a True Hero. For a true hero. <laughs> Such a hilarious movie. Literally, I have not seen like any classic movie. I've never seen The Princess Bride. I haven't seen Mamma Mia. I literally watched Ferris Bueller for the first time like two months ago. Uh, I haven't seen Pretty in Pink. Uh, I didn't watch The Lion King until I was in 8th grade, so I went the first 13 years of my life never having seen The Lion King, despite being born after the film's release. <laughs> Which is so bad. Papa. Don't worry, you're not missing out. Oh. Yeah, but those are like classic American movies. I feel like... Oh, excuse me. You don't have to watch Post 7. That's a hot take. It made me learn guitar. Love it. Ooh, nice. Yeah, I'm in the process of learning guitar. Sleeping Beauty. Dude, okay. <laughs> uh, God, what was my favorite Disney movie growing up? My mom always made us watch Alice in Wonderland, so I always like watched that one a lot. Dude, I hate Power Series. You can watch this. What? No, I'm in the process of learning guitar because I... Initially, I learned ukulele my freshman year of high school. And then I've just been trying to, like, collect all the instruments since then because I have... Like a decade or so of piano experience, which is good because I've got. That means a nice, like, build up of. of... Awesome Wonderland. I mean, you just have to admit. It is. It is. It is. It is. It's so creative. You would love I, r learn it, man. There's there's no no better time to start. Just go for it. The piano is such a fun instrument, and you can learn so much music theory from just studying piano. What is the central inter integral convergence? I don't think we covered that in class. <laughs> I love get get your mind out of the gutter, man. 
You can play clarinet. Oh, hell yeah. I played the flute when I did band. Uh, oh. Yeah, no, we never did integral of convergence. Interval of convergence, I'm sorry. Because there's also radius of convergence. And I emailed my teacher and he's like, yeah, we'll cover that after this exam. Is this frontman does piano? Dude, Muse slaps. I love just rock music in general. Like, that's mostly what I listen to on Spotify. Do not! Oh my god, stop! No, 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 no. Do not say that. <laughs> oh god! Because I don't know what a radius of convergence is. Emma Richu. Okay, yeah. I have not watched a lot of Emma Richu. I remember... God, my favorite videos of hers are, like, the weird anime crush videos that she's had. Because, like, yeah, I agree. Is it just where it converges, or... Let me Google. What is the center of the interval of convergence? Uh, yeah. If I don't know what that means, I'm just going to assume that it's because we didn't cover it in class. It's 4 a.m. How are you still up? I hope you don't have anything important planned tomorrow. You will be sleepy. You have school. Oh my gosh. Are you going to go to bed? Or are you just going to pull an all-nighter? If you posted a link, I uh, it probably got censored. You can send it to me on Discord, though. ba 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 da You're gonna go to bed. That sounds like a good idea, especially if you have school. Sleep is important. It's good for your memory. Yes, good night. Everyone say good night to Mr. Mandic M Mant IDK. Is that how you pronounce it? Good night. Sleeping is overrated. Oh my gosh. After we all said good night. Good night. I don't mind probability functions either. Those are pretty epic. From another class, therefore, always arrives at 9.06, exactly four minutes before class is supposed to start. Find the probability that class starts before she arrives. 
0 represents class starting at 9, 10. A negative value of x representing starts the class early. So at x equals negative 4 would be 906. So would it just be the area under the graph from negative 12 to negative 4 at a height of 0.03? Oh, I can't use my calculator, but I'm going to while I'm studying. One second, I've got to go grab my calculator. really just I don't know how to multiply decimals that's another lesson I never paid attention to in like elementary school <laughs> is multiplying decimals isn't that bad don't multiply decimals what do you mean and I have a scholarship. Exactly. Just add to the stat. <laughs> I think that's correct. Let me check. Oh, hell yeah, I got it right, boys. I can do basic math. But you know what? That's okay. It comes from a fundamental understanding of areas under graphs. That's 24%. Ba da da! What's nice is the multiple choice questions for this. They're always like the same setup. So if you can memorize at least one answer, you've memorized all of the answers. Hacking the system. Ha ha ha. We are grooving tonight, boys. How's the studying? It's going. It's going. I'm trying my best. We're doing math. I have a Twitch chat holding me accountable and judging me for my um, inability to multiply decimals, but we are thriving. 
I studied a lot last night though too, so I do kind of understand what I'm doing. To an extent. But I'm having a good time. Thank you. Yeah, he's kind of... I haven't run him in a while, so there's just like a big chunk just kind of sitting at the bottom. It's like just expanding, but it's not going up. What should we listen to after we're done listening to the soundtrack? Anyone got any soundtrack recommendations? We've got to dodge the copyright police. I don't know how it does either. People just like mathematics, I guess. It's, that's so funny. Honestly. I don't know what prompted it. I don't mind it. Don't get me wrong. Da -da -da -da. Okay. Which of the following could be the formula P of X on the interval from negative 2 to positive 8? Circle all the answers that could be correct. So this is the correct answer. Gonna go and not do homework. Sounds good. Sounds good. Thank you for popping in. Glad, uh... Glad you could stop by and say hi. Should I stream this more often? Is there really a demand for people to watch me do my math? I don't know if I like that. Maybe I will. Physics stream? Physics stream, boys? <laughs> I don't mind it. It's nice because I can, like, actually talk with chat. And be productive at the same time. Like, I don't feel like I'm just wasting my time, like, playing Osu or something. The most views. Yeah. It's kind of bonkers. <laughs> It's crazy. It's crazy, man. That'll be that'll be what gets me famous on Twitch is yeah, you heard a waffles ate me. She just talks about anime and, and does her math homework for, in front of a live audience. Be like, yep, that's me. So the P of X represents the equation and capital P of X represents the derivative. So y equals P of X between negative two. <laughs> you know that homework streamer, <laughs> right? What a fucking nerd. Yeah, she just she just streams her homework. Yeah, waffles Amy. <laughs> Sometimes she's play she plays Minecraft, but I really enjoy her commentary on complex mathematical equations. <laughs> I hate that. So, the equation Px is just point- it's not negative. It looks like it is, because that's- the oh, there's a line there. That's just the equation. It's just a straight line. So then how does this straight line... ...relate back... ...to... ...this? How are these... ...related?
x plus 2.3. If I can just figure out where all the numbers come from, that'd be epic. Hmm. It's a bit of a thinker, boys. Hmm. They're all thinkers, because we're doing homework. But that's okay. That's okay. That's okay. That's okay. That's okay. Uh, I'm just trying to figure out where the x plus 2 comes from and where the point 3 comes from because the cumulative distribution function is just the derivative of that, right? <laughs> That's okay, yeah. Listen, man, listen, man, listen, man. That's just my go-to. Okay, I don't... I don't know. I'm just trying to do math. I need to reassure myself that I'm... I'm aware of what I'm doing. It's just... It's positive reinforcement. I'm... I'm Pavloving myself into liking mathematics. And I can't go to office hours because office hours ended seven minutes ago. So I am a... <laughs> That's okay. You've got to do it five times. You've done it twice. Do it three more. <laughs> well, what if I just plug in a number? Right? Because I think in theory, let me plug in a bunch of numbers and see what all the results are. Or is it the antiderivative? No. No, because I was getting... Oh! Yo, I just had the fattest Eureka moment. Because it's the integral, right, lads? So... Okay. Thank you for the that's okay's jump. I appreciate it. Ta da. Ba da 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 da. Ta da da. Ba. Ba 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 ba. Mm hmm. Anytime, anytime. Yeah, yes, sir, yes, sir. Oh, God. Spider dance goes so hard. That 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 that
Okay, I get this. So like I'm I'm I pulled up a web page. From the interval of negative two x to eight would be the integral from negative two to eight of point oh six x right okay okay so then we take the antiderivative of that which would be raising this to the second power it'd be point three right wait point three over two no point oh six times two gives us point point one two x squared I think would that be the antiderivative because then point one two times two no hmm I've give, I've dug myself a hole haven't I if it's divided by two point oh three times two yeah, okay. So I think, let me check this on integral calculator, but I think the antiderivative of 0.06x is 0.03x squared. Is it? Let's see. Point oh, oh, it's not typing. I love when my numpad just turns off. Oh, actually, I probably shouldn't use the numpad. My end stream key is the plus button. That could be very bad for us boys. Oh, it's not. It's just 0.6. It's not even 0.6x. Oh, wow. That's a clown moment right there, boys. The antiderivative is just putting an x in front of it. Because to take the derivative, it'd be x to the first. Get rid of the... Pro tip slash shortcut derivative of x to the third. You can do the same in reverse. Ah! Yes. Yeah, clown Maddie indeed. Math brings out the worst in me. <laughs> Thank you so much. I appreciate it. For the tip. Subtracting for derivative, adding for Angie. Yeah. I was just trying to reverse engineer it because I wasn't sure. But I ended up just taking the wrong antiderivative. I was trying to take the antiderivative of 0.06, but I ended up taking the antiderivative of 0.06x, which is just a completely different thing. So... Now we've got to evaluate this 
big boy integral. We're doing 0 0.06, negative 2, oh, no, 8, minus 0 0.06. Two? Negative two. What's weird is the answer has an X in it, and so I know it doesn't want me to evaluate the integral, it just wants me to find an equation for it. That's like obviously not an integral. I didn't know AJR released a new album, is it good? Dun, 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 dun. No, you're fine. You're fine. I'm literally streaming myself studying. That in itself is a bit of a distraction. But also Chad is holding me. It's amazing. Yeah. I will have to give it a listen here soon. I can't really listen to it on stream. Oh, it's because you also plug x into the integral. So you take it in, in chunks. That's kind of stupid. I mean, it makes sense, but it's stupid. Because it'd be like... Integral from 0 to x, evaluate it for x, and then it'd be 0 to 1 plus 1 to x for everything. Uh, yep, so derivative of 6x is 0. 0.6. In the original, it's, yeah. Yeah, I get that. I definitely struggle a lot more with antiderivatives than I do derivative derivatives, because those make a lot more sense. Like, like the derivative of, I don't know, 4x to the 7th would be 28x to the 6th. Pee Pee, thank you. Very insightful, Gumi. Sorry, engineer and math nerd, feel free to tell me when to shut up. You're perfectly fine. I appreciate the help. We are just struggling through Calc 2 right now, man. Aw, oh, Temp Shop is playing. Nothing can go wrong when Temp Shop is playing. Ba 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 da da. Hmm. Maddie <laughs> needs all the help I can. Yeah, you're right. Uh, yeah, I 100% appreciate it. Chat has been wonderful this entire stream. I think math has a weird ability to bring people together. Which is like the dorkiest sentence I could have just said, but... You know what I mean. It's fun. Because right now I'm just like trying to reverse engineer the answer. Yes, Gumi, you have been incredibly useful. I'm sure you appreciate. I appreciate your help just as much as everyone else's. Is it working over the entire interval? Because I guess obviously you can't see. Math can bring people together. Yes, it can. Yes, it can. Listen, man. All all eight of us. We're we're grooving today, boys. You know, and it's all thanks to mathematics that we're all here tonight. I also put this under the beginner the beginning 
beginner players category because this is my first year taking calculus and I thought you know what I'm a beginner at calculus <laughs> and math is playing me you're gonna move to your desk all right Gumi have fun so glad you're you're sitting down for this da da I'll just ask this during class, I guess. I'll put a star next to it. There, let me get out a fun, colorful pen for all of you. Like it's pink. I hope I don't just. Eh, you're fine. You're, you'll be fine. So, if I have the integral of 0.6, where the range is from 3 to 10, you'd want to find the antiderivative. Yes. And then you'd want to apply that range. That's what I tried to do. Let me... Okay. I'll explain the problem to you. So, pretty much I'm given a probability density function. And I need to know the probability density function. I'll kind of draw like a rudimentary version of it. So, we have right here... This is x at negative 2. It's a piecewise function. And we're given that the area of the shaded region right here is 0.1. And so uh, this is at a height of 0.03. This is at a point a height of 0 0.06. And y equals p of x, where p of x represents the probability density function. And it's given by this graph. And so unit step function, I don't know if it goes by any other names, but that doesn't sound familiar to me. This is dashed, obviously, because it's piecewise. And so we're given the probability density function, and we need to find the cumulative density function, which you can find by taking the derivative of the probability density function, if I'm remembering correctly. Wait, I have my notes right here. And so we need to find the cumulative density function for the range between negative 2 and 8. So I thought we just take the integral of negative 2 to 8 of 0.06x, because the derivative or the antiderivative of that is just given by that. But apparently that's not correct, because the correct answer is the probability density function of the area can be given by 0.06. 06 x plus 2 plus 0.3 and I guess I'm confused because I don't understand where this plus 2 and where this 0.3 are coming from Now, P of T is the integral of I wish I wrote down more definitions. Hmm, big think.
<laughs> we are just learning tonight, boys. I'm trying my best. Uh, I'm not sure about the probability of this, so it's making me hard to give useful feedback. That's perfectly fine. Uh, I'm not expecting feedback from Twitch chat. I'm responsible for my own education at the end of the day. But, uh, I, d I appreciate any, any help. Do not get me wrong. But it's okay. We can all just learn this stuff together. That's the point of studying, isn't it? I'm just trying to understand my own work from this because I like found the value for C. Because there's no derivative for this, so I don't think P, the cumulative density function. No, 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 no. I mean, I'm confusing myself with this, I think. God, I've dug a rabbit hole. Hmm. Derivative, yeah. Constants become zero when driving. Yeah, that's where I'm confused because at least I thought the probability or like the the CDF. I forget what it stands for. It's um cumulative distribution function. It's just the derivative of the probability density function. That's what I thought. Maybe I misinterpreted it, but. <laughs> Apparently there's also, like, stuff with limits. The integral is just the... Between... Maybe thinking it... Yeah. Yeah. You're right. And the bounds in this case, for this function, are negative 2. So I think I wonder If the total area under that Is 0.3 Because then that'll make sense where it's coming from 10 Times 0.06 Is 0.6 That's the total area Here wait, let me get another color total area under this curve right there that red bit is 0.6 so where's the point 3 coming from that represents like a halfway point you could argue half of that area is point 3 Oh, you know what area is 0.3, though? You know what area is 0.3? I think I just figured it out. So the area, because the other point on this graph, I don't know how well you can see it, chat, but the other area under this graph is from negative 12 to 2 at 0 .3, 0 0.03. So 10 times 0 0.03 gives us that. Oh my god. Oh my god, I just freaking figured it out. So, it's just the area of this section, because it has to already automatically be factored in, because it's assuming that it's in a value above negative 2. And then to figure out um, any point past that, because it can't be at negative 2, because then it would be at point 3. It has to be above negative 2. If it's at negative 1... What if it's at negative one? That's... Hmm... Because I'm 
I'm wondering where the plus two comes comes into play. Because I understand why it's plus three now, or plus point three. Does the... Because... Okay, wait. Point oh six, negative one plus two, plus point three, gives us point three six. And that should be the total area of like, I need another color. It's negative one. That should be the total area of this little chunk. For example, three minus minus negative four. If your lower bound is negative, you're still subtracting it even though it's, oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I'm wondering if this total area, if it's equal to point three six. Because if it's equal to point two, that just gives us the value of like this chunk or negative two. I'm sorry, because then it just becomes zero. Maybe it's just because it's... Because the origin is at zero, obviously. But the start of the new graph is at negative two, so is that plus two to, like, offset the origin? Does that even make sense? Is that math? <laughs> oh, God. Well, it'd just be nine times... Or it'd just be 1 times 0 0.06. Plus yeah. Okay, wait. I think I get this now. Pog. Pog. It only took like 30 minutes, but we brute forced our way and we figured out why it makes sense. Do you know anything about convergence and divergence? Because that's what's next, boys. Following geometric series. I'll write it in purple. N squared and cosine N over square root N to the eighth minus N plus one. Disgusting. First, we need to determine if it converges or diverges. I have a flow chart for this that my teacher gave us. I also have several tabs open, so I need to close several of the tabs I have open for my own well being. <laughs> I need to go to my email. Okay, cool. So does the do the terms approach something other than zero? So as n gets bigger, the bottom's gonna get bigger. I think I just use comparison test for this. I'd argue I would, but can I be a hundred percent certain in that? Yeah, yeah. You use the comparison test on this, boys. So it'd be 
God, I have so many pens. I just like being able to talk through my thinking, I think. And then you, as the chat, will just hold me accountable if my thinking is wrong. <laughs> yeah, because we can, at the end of the day, reduce this to simple terms. Because, like, as n gets bigger, this and this won't matter. But these two boyos will. So, essentially, at the end of the day, it's n squared over n to the eighth root. <laughs> And you can rewrite that as n squared over n to the fourth, which you can then write as 1 over n squared, and compare the two. So we've got this thing in mathematics. And it's very stupid. And they call it the p-test. And essentially, with the p-test, you determine... Gross math indeed. Spike, I hate it. But you know what? I'm thriving. Also, hi. Haha, <laughs> piss test. Yes. Me and the homies doing a piss test. One second, lads. I'm getting a phone call. I've got to switch to my BRB screen. Also, the song slaps. That... Hello.
Holy shit, you gifted the sub. Ha <laughs> ha. Hello, I'm back. I'm back. I'm switching screens. I've got to uh, reconnect my camera really quick because I uh, made the uh, three head move of uh, needing to use my phone for camera. So anytime I want to do something, it looks like this. This is my phone. Look at it. Ha ha. Ha ha ha. Silly. There we go. We're back. Yeah, Maddie dumb. Maddie's also an engineer. I'm not that poor. You just gifted me a sub, so we're fine. I'll get Bezos money soon. Also, I saw that you followed. Thank you so much. Why is my desktop audio? Did, did the music just, like, time out again? I don't have a camera. Nope. Dude, we finished listening to the entire Undertale soundtrack. What should we listen to now? Uh, Colors and Mayhem Universe B is a good album. We're not listening to Chug Jug. Number one, Victory Royale. Yeah, Fortnite. About to get down. 10 kills on the board right now. I just wiped out Tomato Town. Number one victory royale. Yeah, Fortnite, we about to get down. Get down. <laughs> Dun -bun. It's nice and foreboding. But it's also DMCA safe. Which is so nice. Because like there are some absolute bangers. On Colors and Mayhem. What have you done? <laughs> <laughs> okay, I forget what I was talking about. The comparison test. I had to take a phone call. Neglect mathematics. Only do phone calls. Okay, we use the limit comparison test. I want to do some research on that, because I don't completely know what it is. I know of its existence, but I do not know what it is. Limit. Compare. Compare. Comp compare. I can't spell. I'm a STEM major for a reason. Paul's online notes. Thank you, Paul. You're very epic. Stupid Twitch Mobile not letting me pull up the points thing. Ha ha ha! No, but you're not gonna use your channel points here, bud. Joke's on you. I've oh, I finished this water bottle. One second. I have one whole other water bottle to work through. Hell yeah. Water Pog. Oh, but I can do the bits button. Of course Bezos has his priorities straight. The man's a billionaire. I'm sure he factored in all of his money when doing this. This is the Bezos Bucks button. That dude, you are honestly so hilarious. I absolutely love it. Your sense of humor is keeping me going as I suffer through the hell that is calculus. You just divide the... The limits by one another? 
Reloaded the stream, that's fine. Okay, epic. Because, like, what they did was n plus 2, n cosine, n. Oh, my hand is so bad. I'd say don't worry, I could... I... Hey, you know what? That's kind of cool, though. You know... You're, like, pursuing what you want to do. You should just do that, to be honest. Oh, yeah, F. <laughs> Do you, you just divide by whatever you're comparing it to? So then this becomes n to the fourth plus n to the third. Stinky, n to the third. Can't wait till I get 8k. Oh god. I- I'm not looking forward to that. Gumi has 8k points right now, and I'm very scared for the day that Redeem Spanish becomes actually used, because, uh, especially when I'm studying. I- I can't- I don't know Spanish math terms. I- I- I, I just- I don't know. No. Oh god. That that would make me cry. <laughs> I would cry so badly. No. I'll try to teach physics in Spanish. And a few hydrates too for good men. No. <laughs> oh my god, jump. Crying in Spanish. <laughs> oh, I will tell you, chat. I have a uh, physics test next week. Cries in streamer. <laughs> I have a physics test next Monday, so uh, we'll just do this again. I won't actually be in my dorm room, which will be epic. I'll be dog sitting uh, back home. So my setup will be different, but I'll figure out how to set it up. Because I'll have to bring, like, my computer and shit. This at the end of the day. It's just end of the fourth over end of the fourth. The limit. As n approaches positive infinity. n over four of n over four is just one. And since it's one... It converges. You know what's fun too is my AC is broken in my dorm room right now. And it's getting warmer. And I am just toasty as frick. You want some Bezos bucks? Because I have like two or three bucks, so I might as well. That is up to you. The soon, the sooner, I just need $28 before Mr. Bezos can give me um, my first payout. And I can... AC broken gang, hell yeah. Broken AC gang. You can give me Bezos bucks if you want. Use them on text-to-speech. It's only two bucks. Yeah, literally, it's hell. I sleep in a loft bed. AC, air conditioning. I sleep in a loft bed, so, like, heat rises, right? So, I just, I melt. Oh, you don't have air conditioning either. God, we're all suffering. You don't own one? Oh god, that's almost worse. <laughs> I 
A tier two sub? Holy shit! Holy cow! That's my first tier two sub. Holy cow! Thank you, whoever did that. Holy guacamole! Wow, I appreciate it so much. Yeah, no, whomever did that. You don't want to give up, so you're not going to do it. This is my favorite song of Colors in Mayhem Universe A. Yeah, very cool person. We, we appreciate you all. Where's Blue? Blue's probably doing his own homework. Because he's also a struggling college student. Yeah. Dun dun. I love Gold, Gold Pilot so much. I'm turning this up for you guys because you can enjoy it too. It's so good. It's got the nice split audio channels. Anything with split audio, I automatically, like, almost am guaranteed to, <laughs> to like. Dum, bum, 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 bum. Oh, okay, hell yeah. The synths that are so nice. Anything with synths, I just, I love. Radioactive on the- oh my god. That's a throwback. Are you breathing in the chemicals? Waking up to ash and dust? Wipe your brow, sweat your breast? No, it will not be. It will not be 10 years old. You did not just say that. Yeah, no. It will not be 10 years old. We, I pretend not to hear. I cannot hear. I, I do not hear. I cannot hear what you are saying. I will fight you. Thursday. Rotunda. Be there, be square. I know this song on the piano, too. That's how much I love this song. It's 6 p.m. What if I want to be a polyhedron? Become polyhedron. Neglect society. Become, become geometric shape. <laughs> Hell yeah, polyhedron gang. Dum bum bum ba dum bum bum ba dum bum bum ba dum bum bum ba da 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 bum 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 ba dum ba da 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 bum. What did Huey Lewis in the news say? It's hip to be square. Hell yeah, it is. Bum, 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 ba da da. You know how it's actually pronounced? You can redeem Spanish now. No, you cannot. 
but it's better this way. Look, math is dangerous. I want to <laughs> in, in the hospital. I am going to tell that joke to. I'm telling that to my to my teacher tomorrow. Yeah, I stayed up late studying last night, professor. I ended up in the lay hospital. Wee wee. I wish I was doing math. Right now I'm just pretending I know what I'm doing. I've got like my notes and my actual work. Like I'm doing work. Look, you can see it's all cute and color coded and shit and like that's math. That's that's math, it sure is. But uh <laughs> Secret of Engineering, everyone pretends that I genuinely feel like that's how it's going. That's what my physics class is like right now. We're all just... You still don't know what you're doing. Me neither. Me neither, me neither, me neither. I can't spell either. That's why I'm a STEM major. Alright, I'm gonna turn the music down a little bit. Is that good? Can you guys still hear it? I just don't want it to be like obnoxious. <laughs> That's okay. You can be a writer and just not know how to spell. I mean, Grammarly exists. This sentence is confusing, but Grammarly can help. The series, terms in the series are not positive, but it's also not an alternating series. We consider this series, so that's absolute value. I feel like I'm in a cathedral listening to these echoey boys. The echo lads. Echo. A coral. That's the right word. No, no one in my physics class knows what they're doing. It's like a collective. Alright. What series is score on Rotten Tomatoes? I don't know what show you're talking about. The series I'm doing, uh, honestly, it's probably like 12%. It brings me too much pain. A dummy didn't give- I'm sorry, it's literally small brain hours. Three head hours, man. I know some of the series did- I had at least five episodes of Rage <laughs> <laughs> yeah! I'm experiencing that right now. I don't know what the Taylor series is. The series finale was amazing, though. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. That's clown waffles. I like Sadie, though. Sadie carries some power with her, too. Me right now. Is that Foggy Rains 147? It might be. 
it's only in the username. <laughs> the legendary foggy rains 147 indeed the icon themselves hell yeah Are you a shiny? Are you weak to electric? <laughs> Can I use it? <laughs> you guys both made Pokemon jokes, and I absolutely love that. Spike and that dude right now are communicating on a level that the rest of us cannot understand, nor fully comprehend. Oh, is rain? I hear rain. Hi, Blue. Oh, you're sad. Blue. <laughs> Foggy Rain 147 is in the chat. You're not sad. Oh, that's good. Just sad -y. Ah, yes, I see. It is a powerful emote. The tier 2 sub is here. It's a shame I don't have any tier 2 sub emotes yet. There's no incentive to sub above tier 1. Um, converges by the geometric series test. Do they get a better multiplier? Yeah, I think they do. Waffles is pretty pog. Thank you. I, I'm, I'm glad you think I'm pog. It's taken a long time to achieve that title. What do they mean by the geometric series test? Geometric series convergence test. Series convergence tests on math2.org. Oh hell yeah, you do get a better multiplier. Imagine needing a point multiplier. This this post was made by Infinite Points Gang. Yeah, but Spike, you're a mod. I can just uh, give you um, give you points. Will I do that? No, I don't want to inflate the economy. All about the points. <laughs> you have a three month sub. Yeah, I know you do. And that is pretty epic as well. Da, 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 da. Bum, bum, da, 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 da,
I'll show you, Epic. Oh, of course you will. That's your go-to. I still need to make that compilation. I wish you could. Can't. Well, can't you just change your Founder's Badge out for the normal Waffle Badge? Oh, if it's a geometric cons... If the absolute value of R is less than 1, the geometric series... Oh, geometric series... Spike, I like you already. <laughs> <laughs> then the series converges to A over 1 minus R. Thanks, I like me too. We love self-love. If R is greater than or equal to 1, the big boy diverges. And we know, in this case, this is a geometric series with the ratio 1 over E. Right? Yeah, 1 over E. I'd give you money right now if my card wasn't locked for fraud. Why is it locked for fraud? That's a bit of jump floor. I... I'm one of my few friends who does anymore. Oh! L. <laughs> Waffles, should I stream Electrochem one of these days? You absolutely should. You absolutely should. Me and my homies only stream Electrochemistry. Yeah, the common ratio is 1 over E, which is less than 1, which means it diverges. Do it, do it, do it, do it. Study stream? Cough, cough, Maddie, cough, cough. What about it? What about me? You've got nine viewers from Calc, so it might be worth it. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> yeah, so one over E is less than one. So, uh, not. I'm learning to love myself. It's a process. Top three streams lots of water, a bunch of water, and some water. Hell yeah. Me gusta agua. I love how this is... Yeah, right? It's so ironic because it was supposed to be like really chill and whatever. Oh, you just looked up the engineering tag and ended up here because you have nothing better to do. Yeah, it's kind of funny. <laughs> Might instantly kill. <laughs> Bro. It honestly would. That's so funny that you came here from the engineering tag, because, like, most of my audience these days comes from, like, Minecraft, because everyone's playing Minecraft on Twitch right now, <clears throat> because of a certain green man, and anime, because, like, everyone can talk about anime, especially when I'm playing Osu. So, like, most of my audience comes from either Minecraft or Osu, and it's so weird to see that, like, this stream is doing well, because it's so out of the norm of my other streams. Like, I do my painting homework live, too. Dude, poor Ludwig. Poor, poor Ludwig. I feel so bad for that man. He still has 13 hours. God, when I looked at, like, 8, no, 7 o'clock, he only had 6 hours left. And then he came back, and it was like, it went up by 7 hours. That man is never going to be free. He is being held hostage by his chat. Yeah, that does not sound like fun. I looked up engineering a few times just to see what's out there. Last time I ended up spending three hours talking to someone. Designed a 16-bit computer. Wow. Wait, that's so cool. 
That's so cool. Yeah, I saw that. I thought about, like, you know, how funny it would be just to, like, donate 100 subs. That's so much money. It's, like, $500. But, like, just to see what, what his reaction would be. God, that'd be so funny. But then you're banned for the rest of the subathon, and I just want to see it unfold. Yeah, there are some super cool things you can find on, on, on Twitch, like, in, in the tags. I really underappreciate, or I think the, the tags are kind of underappreciated. Uh, for what they are. I put this under, uh, yeah, it is. I put this under beginning, be beginner player, because this is my first year studying calculus, too. So, um, calculus, comma, T-O-O. -O. Uh, I, I took calc one last semester. Dinopog. It's a lizard! It's not a dinosaur. And don't give me the, well, dinosaurs are lizards. I know. Okay. Calculus gets worse. I'm not looking forward to that. I have to go up to Calculus 4. A snake with legs. Yeah. I was one class away from a math mate. Oh my god. Disgusting. I mean, good for you. Should you eat or sleep? Have you have you eaten today? If so, how much? If you feel like you need food, you should just eat. Listen to your body. Oh my god. <laughs> that dog is so cute. Hi, buddy. Is neither an option? Oh no! I need to five head the ball. <laughs> Hell yeah. Dun, dun, dun. What's up? What am I gonna do once I hit 75 followers? Change the follower goal to 100? I don't know. What do you think I should make for a follow goal? Eat a frozen waffle on stream. Oh my god. Yeah, is the thing broken? Uh... Because the sub goal didn't update either. Ego! Let the waffle eat me. What a terrifying thought. The, the, the goal might be frozen. Wait, let me... I'll run te the test widget. During stream. Yeah, it goes. You can hear the little doot noise. We good. We good. It works. Should I eat a good burrito? Stop chewing my hair. I'm not chewing my hair. I'm not doing it. My hair is pulled back right now. You should eat the burrito. Burrito good. Oh, no, you can't even see my face, so how do you know if I'm eating a burrito or not? That's okay, I can't spell either. My actual counter... 
parents' intuition. Oh my god. My actual, like, counter on my page doesn't update till after the stream. But the little bar should update. I don't know why it's not working. Because I think the sub one is broken too, because I've gotten two subs this whole stream. 11 viewers? No way. There's no way. How do you know if I'm eating a burrito or not? Because it says, eat good burrito or commence big slumber. Burrito pog. Burrito pog. Dun, 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 dun. It dropped to 10. That's okay. It's because we called out one of the viewers. Did I really? <laughs> Listen, man. Math brain think different. Math brain think different. Senor Spike, it looks like you might be eating a burrito. Think it's burrito time. I wish I had a burrito. There are absolutely no Mexican restaurants, like no good Mexican restaurants near me, and it sucks. Math brain equals dead brain. Yeah, it's sad, but it's true. Okay, so the limit of a n as n approaches infinity. As this number gets big, it just becomes almost zero. It's like um. Xenox paradox, right? Where you've got like 1 over 2, 1 to the 4th, 1 to the 8th, 1 to the 16th. It's just going to keep getting smaller until it's big ol' 0. But it will never actually reach 0. It's an asymptote. Oh, that's great. I'm so jealous. Literally all the food where I live is so expensive. I paid $25 for a waffle and two eggs on Saturday. For breakfast. I got a coffee, I got a waffle, two eggs, and bacon, and it was 25 fucking dollars. And that's so expensive for, like, just basic food. American healthcare be like, what do you mean? Oh, paying $25 for breakfast. Creeper. Oh man. Hell yeah. Blue and I were thinking on the same wavelength tonight. Okay, so the limit... The limit as n approaches infinity. Cookie. You know what place is open? It's insomnia cookies. If I really wanted, I could take a study break and order cookies. But I don't want to spend any more money this week because I have to go home on Thursday. <laughs> and so I need money to like actually... K is zero. N. The sum of A, K from Big Bang Micro... No! No, no, no. Do not microwave styrofoam. Do not microwave styrofoam. That is such a bad idea. Do you want to ingest dangerous chemicals? Did you wake up this morning and be like, mm, yes. Carcinogens. Do not dissolve styrofoam and acetone either. Do not breathe the fumes that come from di dissolving styrofoam and acetone. That is a big ol' yikes. A big no no. No, bad. bad chemicals.
We don't want bad chemicals here, boys. Says the one who was inhaling paint. We don't talk about that. Oil paint is different. Oil paint's just... It does basically disappear. It can You can reform, I think, the dissolved styrofoam into some sort of plastic. I mean, you can try it, but don't inhale it, because... Let's look up the reaction. St How do you spell styrofoam? Styrofoam in acetone. Yeah. Styrofoam mostly consists of air. When it dissolves in acetone, it completely loses its structure. Let me look at the reaction reaction. Because I think it does make a gaseous product on top of, like, this weird, like, styrofoamy liquid. Because I watched, was it the King of Random do something? Where he, like, made a knife out of styrofoam, like, redissolved styrofoam? Boy, why would you buy a gallon of concentrated? Do I have a Tanjiro keychain behind my desk? Why? Can you see it? Where is Tanjiro? No, there's nothing. Oh, yeah, I do. That's my backpack. <laughs> yeah, 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 that's Tanjiro. That's my backpack. Here, wait, I'll go grab it. I have to make sure I, like, don't accidentally reveal my face. What is Lim- Oh, gosh. Y'all are playing with fancy things. Imagine having access... Those kinds of things? Do backpack reveal? Backpack reveal? Hell yeah. Do not actually play with chemicals. As a chemist, don't play with chemicals. Yes, don't play with chemicals. Unless you have supervision from the teacher. Here, Tanjiro keychain. Tanjiro keychain. Let me get it off my backpack. Because I don't want to, like, dox the school I go to. Look it, here he is. Little buddy. Yeah, you can always do, like, a home experiment. Make oobleck or some shit. Me and my homies love oobleck. Small sword boy. Yes, I love him. Oh, there's... N huh. Interesting. Oh, it's water time. Look, you'll see me. This is the water. This is me drinking the water. Mmm. Delicious. It's the force behind the thing. What? <laughs> What's- where's the time? I saw the water, but not the time. Is it bussin' Mally? Hell yeah it is! Water's always bussin' blue. Is that how you pronounce that? I'm kind of a boomer with the zoomer lingo. It do be- yes. It really do. Okay, I pronounced it right. Pog. Kyle said bussin be best. 3 a.m. water hits different. It do. Like, water from the sink hits different? A nos. A nos. This is like 1 over 1 plus 1 over 2. Oh, <laughs> 
Your emotes convey so much fear. Well, I guess, like, every subsequent value after 1 over 1 will just get incredibly close to 1. But never equal it, right? The sum. Can we listen to my favorite Minecraft song? This is so random, but I'm just like thinking of music to play that's like DMCA safe. We're gonna listen to my favorite Minecraft song. I'll pull it up on a new tab. Ho ho ho! If I can remember how to spell it. It's the fancy disc. Ho ho, found it. I found it, boys. It slaps. <laughs> it's kind of spooky, but I like spooky music. <laughs> the real question is, chat, should I show this VOD to my professor so he can really understand how much I understand his class? Or do you think he'd be too embarrassed to know that one of his students used his math problems and gained money from it and he did not? Like, yo, teach. It's just like I've debated showing my art teacher my painting VODs. Hello, Robert Ross. It's a pleasure to have you in chat. Bob. 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 <laughs> Ask my professor the tier 3 sub. Oh my god. What a power move. Oh my god. As funny as that would be, you know, that's a good idea. I don't think I would ever, I don't think I have the balls to do that. But that'd be so funny. One more follower. Oh no, we need two. The counter's off because I tested my widget. <laughs> Foggy, you're just playing with the emotes and I love it. Let me... Yeah, 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 yeah. I wonder if I can, like, refresh it? Two then. Yes, just two. We love the pride in the chat, man. Okay. Oh, music over. Damn. No thoughts. Head empty. Nintendo music. <laughs> okay, we'll go back to Colors and Mayhem. Hell yeah. You died. Welcome back, Gumi. Glad to see you're here. We're still just- we're still cranking- cranking out, having fun times with the numbers. We have a bunch of emotes just vibing. Gumi's back. Glad you're back. Glad you're here. You're gonna die quick. Oh, okay. Yeah, your Wi-Fi is gonna... Okay. I'll talk to you later. Have a good night. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, dun, dun. The wild foggy has fled. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's why I should have used a master ball. Yeah, Spike was right.
You're gonna lurk? Alrighty, jump. I'll be here. I've got no signs of stopping. I'm just here learning math until my brain implodes. <sighs> A few more blue wolves away from them all. You need 224, man. <laughs> You're dedicated. Hell yeah. I think this is a geometric sequence because it'd be like five over one minus three. Right, right, right. I think it would. 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 No, it'd be 15. 15? No! It wouldn't. I'm skipping this song. No lyrics here, boys. <laughs> Saving my points. <laughs> That's what we'll do. If someone redeems change game, I'll just switch to another subject. Yeah, yeah, I made sub badges, so now you've got a waffle by your name. You're subscribed, so you have access to my emotes and stuff. <laughs> Change subjects to differential equations for maximum point efficiency. I don't even know how to do diff EQ. I don't want to. I don't want to think about diff EQ. I've heard it's fun though, and by fun I mean torturous. The point to pain ratio is high with this one. <laughs> oh yeah. Pee pee. Pee pee. Pee pee. Thanks, Spike. Yes, thank you. Hi, Gumi. does have an anime tag. You missed it. We were talking about anime a while ago. Nearly all my streams have the anime tag because I can start that conversation should anyone uh, provoke it. Earlier people were judging my taste for Madoka. Which I don't like, but that's okay. <laughs> Thank you, Spike. Very cool. No, it's honestly been such a fun night. I've, I've had a great time just vibing with people. We've talked about a lot of things. And I'll probably go until like 1 o'clock or something. So like 4 hours stream is... I mean, it's long, but... It's so fun. Mm-hmm. 
Mm hmm. <laughs> you guys are having so much fun with your emotes. Oh my god, wait. You, you're you subbed to Wilbur? I can't even talk. Brain cell degradation. You do not put chat into emote only. You leave chat be. I like fish, like fish, but with a B. Fish. Fish. It's like, what do you call a fish with no eye? A fish. A fish. <laughs> Raccoon. I'm only sub to Kyle right now. I use because I only have a prime, so I can use the Sharingan. Ho ho! Rack attack. Oh, that's what it's called. That's so funny. That just shows you how much I know about Twitch culture. Absolutely nothing. And I've been my account is like six years old. I can't even read this. The quality of this PDF document is so poopy. <laughs> yeah, no. I didn't really start getting back into Twitch until, like, quarantine. Yeah, stinky PDF. What is that one? In in the middle between Mr. Soot Hmm, Spike <laughs> Yeah, one of those is not like the other. <laughs> e seven E. I think it's diabolical to give a question. E different parts. Fwag. Euler approves of part E. E Euler has no mean on part E. Mr. Euler is the reason I am suffering right now. Dude, me and my homies hate Isaac Newton. He's the reason I'm here right now. Sat in my dorm room, looking at numbers. Jump, I am... Mm. <sighs> Newton, yeah. These lads just had to go and invent more math. What is that? Where are you... Where are you getting these emotes, Spike? How many people are you subscribed to? Exactly! He really said, let me just put every single emote into chat. Gifted subs. Damn. You get gifted subs? Imagine. I've never gotten a gifted sub, ever. Granted, how frequently do I watch Twitch streams? Mm. I actually have to use stinky like hospital rule. Yeah, no. I didn't realize it happens that frequently for you. <laughs> I know, ironic. 
But yeah, I've never been gifted a sub. I had someone... I was in Phil's a Minecraft's chat, and I was like, I have a test, everyone wish me good luck, and someone sent me a DM wishing me good luck, and it was the nicest thing anyone's ever done for me on Twitch. Uh, outside of my own streams, of course. You guys are awesome. Yeah, people are nice. I don't know, I feel like especially on Twitch, it's very hit or miss with, like, people being nice. You've been gifted subs a lot? Can't be me. Y'all are just flexing. Shut up, that's a dead meme. It is not 2018 anymore. Thank you, yes, cease. This man out here is really quoting TikToks from 2018. Oh, yo, the first derivative of 1e to the 3 over 2 is 0. Or 1 minus e. Can I see the steps, please? I would like to give a massive shout out to uh, derivativecalculator.org.net, I'm sorry, for uh, carrying me this semester in um, developing an understanding of complex numbers. I kid is joke. Okay. I'm just sore and cranky. Oh no. Did you eat your burrito? Oh wait, it's because this is a number and this is a number. Oh, yeah. Okay. You did eat your burrito. That's epic. And A sub N, was it? It better be. Me and my homies being drum majors. Bustent doesn't begin to establish the feeling of joy I felt when the when hot taco sauce entered my mouth. That is such a weird sentence. Dare I say, it. oh my god. I'm so glad you had an ethereal experience with your microwaved burrito. I hope it was <laughs> everything it could be and more. A burrito that defies expectations. Some burritos do hit different. I agree. I love, like, when there's rice in a burrito. I just love rice. In a styrofoam container. Spike, you scare me sometimes. I haven't either. I can't remember the last time I had a burrito. Now I kind of want one. Rice does make a burrito. Rice is so good. Mmm, styrofoam <laughs> juice flavored burrito. Perhaps the carcinogens you created made the burrito five times more enjoyable. Yes, rice is- I could eat it without like, anything. 
Like, I have, like, rice, and I, I make, like, um, eggs with a little bit of soy sauce and stuff. Yes, polymer additives in your food. Mm, just uh, ascend it to the next plane. <laughs> yeah, Teflon is, Teflon is very pog. I would have Teflon with my burrito any day of the week. Yeah. I'm a classy pogger. I prefer <laughs> carbon fiber. Yeah. Carbon fiber. It's a close second for me. For a sleek aerodynamic burrito. <laughs> yes. Oh my gosh, yes. Little green thallium pellets. Oh my. Wait, that's. T <laughs> oh no. <laughs> you are what you eat. This says I ate a race car. So I'm proving them. <laughs> there you go. Are you saying you eat rat poison, Spike? You do eat rat poison. Okay. Oh, you're... Okay. <laughs> you eat the rat poison before the rats can eat a certain time. Dude, what a fucking power play. <laughs> yes. It's precisely what you should do. Just ask my homies. <laughs> Start some bullshit. What what does that mean? What'd you start? <clears throat> oh god. I hate that. I'm so sorry for you. I'll plan your funeral. Listen, Orgo is the reason I'm not becoming a doctor. Me and my eight brain cells do not want to prepare for Orgo. I have to take Orgo too. That's inevitable. But like Pchem? Ew. Pchem? We don't know her. Pchem scares me. We shouldn't talk about drugs. Not here. Actually, I don't even know what you're talking about. I'm gonna pretend I don't know what you're talking about. Excuse me. I had the best lunch from my school dining hall today. It was freaking pork katsu curry and it had onions and fried pork and rice again rice pog um dude it was so good rice yes A body-centered cubicle. Oh my gosh. Like an ogre. It, yes. I think Spike and Blue are just in, in two very different states of mind right now. Find patients and post it in the Discord. Okay. Hell yeah. Chemical structures, Pog? 
back to burritos. Go off. Hell yeah, do it. Too much pain. Too brain. It's those carcinogens. Yeah, there's a Discord in my panels. If you scroll. You'll see, like, the about. Oh, go right ahead, sir. I don't have command set up. I should get set up Nightbot eventually, but that takes time, and I uh, don't have much of that as a student. Yeah, no, we don't have Nightbot. We're lazy here. <laughs> Lazy 100. Ayo, hey, what's E to the... Well, no, wait. Yeah, Nightbot exists. Right now we just have auto mod and a few other... Like, actual moderators. One of them isn't even here. I don't know where my other mod is. He's he's probably off watching Spider Isekai anime, to be 100% honest with you. Unless he's lurking, but I don't see his username in, in users in chat, so. Where he's gone off to, I have no idea. <laughs> I just saw that you joined the Discord, and your profile picture makes me anxious. It looks like lots of things. Oh my god. Is that the organic chemistry tutor? Is that his thumbnails I see? I recognize that black screen and primary colors either. Someone should do TTS for 200 bits. I would... Don't you have bits? Yeah, dude, the organic chemistry tutor is literally carrying me in physics right now. That man is such a, a blessing to students. I, I, I love his work. Because <laughs> this is just three times zero. Each of, the, each of the zero is one. So this is just one minus one over one half over zero. This is just zero over zero. So then, how do we use Mr. Hospital's rule. rule. Let me google Le Hospital rule because Le Hos P Your card is locked. What is up with both Oh, I was gonna say, what is up with both you and Jump, but you are Jump. I didn't realize that you and Spike have the same color. I'm not dyslexic, but I'm bad at reading. <laughs> yeah. You do have the same color. Color with an O. We are Americans, boys. Except you, Jump. You're not an American. Imagine. You delete it. <laughs> oh my god. The mods. This is how civil wars start. I'm gonna get an email from Mr. Justin Trudeau for the... The erasure is joke. <laughs> no America slander. I guess not. A 
<laughs> slander anyways. Oh no. That's a big ol' yikes. I've confused myself because I used the hospital rule, right? And it was like a... There's a camera in the bushes. What? What? I spell gray that way though too. Ah! I, we, yeah, we use both grays. I spell it with an E because I think it looks better visually. But that might just be a... <laughs> an opinion of mine. Dun 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 Oh, it's just a prank. It's just a prank. It's just a prank, bro. So glad. Bum bum. Bum bum. Bum bum. Bum bum. We took the limit, right? And it gave me just zero over zero. So then how, if you took the limit and you got zero over zero, can you arrive at negative three? Since this limit is in the form of zero over zero. Yeah, yucky limits indeed. Uh, we solve this by applying the hospital rule. Okay, that's great. But now what? Jump back to 432. Holy frick! PPS, but their card is locked. Hashtag main. Huh, huh, that scared me so much! Oh my god, that scared me so much! <laughs> it's like... <laughs> oh no! The TTS lady just spooks me. It is! Like, like if you're not in expecting a call and someone just like, Boonoo! 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 And you're just sat there, you're doing your math homework. And Discord is just like, hmm, yes, I will startle you. I don't get startled, I just get upset. Because I'm usually busy, oh. I mean, that too, but... I don't get startled, things around me just magically get broken. Oh no! <laughs> oh. I thought I was- Oh! There's so much disappointment in that little smile. Or, not smile, it's a frown. The rules say you're all my little pouch. That's true. It's in the rules. It's in the rules. But if I want to be your big po Oh. The man has a point. Meme champ. New role. New role in the discord. We have the master... The, ma the the word master, the farm master, the master of smarts. Perhaps we need a meme master in the Discord. 
Hmm. Big questions. You gotta donate money. Enough money so Maddie can get a Bezos check. Then you can. Or just post some good news. Bezos bucks. Bezos bucks. That's true. I promise I do more than just calculus. Right now I don't, but... Eventually. I also suck at Osu. Indeed I do. Because I play in the most abhorrent way humanly possible. I, I'm bad at Minecraft too. Any game I play, I'm bad at. It's it's just... Yes. Yes, yes. It's it's cursed, isn't it, Gumi? You've been there since since Osu stream day one. Just M to your gaming. That is what it is. That's what you sign up for. You tune into twitch.tv TV waffles ate me. Hydration nation. Water time, boys. Mm. Delicious. M to your content. Hydration pog. Hydration. We love water. Spanish time? If you want. I don't think I'm ready. I Like I always say, M is worse than the L. Yes. We take so many L's that we moved on to the next al alphabet letter. Ba -da -ba -ba -da -da -da. Look at this pirate song. Is this what I think it is? Oh, no. It does build off the motif from that song, though. That's Pog. Dude, I love musical motifs. Pirate music. Oh no! Coffee's technically water. We've had this conversation. Cause like, it's just bean water. Dum bum. Okay, wait, I get how this works. Put some cyanide in there, and then they'll never see- Oh my god! Bean water! Yes! <laughs> Coffee slaps, though. Yeah, that's what your kidneys do. Your nephrons. Nephron gang? Right? That's the cells in your kidneys. Because nephrology is... Oh, yeah. Mm. How do you drink Kool-Aid? Kool-Aid out of what? Nephron gang. Yes. Me and my homies using our nephrons. I love Mr. Le Hospital. You drink your Kool Aid out of a Brita pitcher? We have like a separate pitcher at, at my house for like, you have the Brita filter. And then the Kool-Aid pitcher. Like, two different things. T 
toxic amounts of copper and ammonia. Oh, mm -mm, big yikes. My last chemistry post. I see, I see, I see, I see. Que interesante. Lo siento, no es la tiempo de español. We don't drink Kool-Aid up here. <laughs> yeah, that is a big L. Only caffeinated. That's just the diet of a college student, man. <laughs> Not wild and oh my god. I've cut down on caffeine surprisingly too. I don't know if it's just because I've been sleeping a little better. But that's on self improvement, boys. Isn't the derivative of 1 over x natural log? I want to, like, put money on it that it is, but I cannot remember for the life of me. Notice me, Bezos Senpai. <laughs> notice me, Bezos Senpai! <laughs> Bezos will notice you one day. I promise you that, dude. I slept till three, but I still got, like, nine whole hours of sleep. And that's pretty epic. It is. Okay, the derivative of 1 over. Yes, 9 hours is so epic. We don't want words in our music today. You're gonna go to bed? Alright, Spike. That sounds like a good idea. Sleep, Pog. No mods. Big yikes. That means if you nerds want to do uh, TTS, you have to tell me, and then I'll approve it. Which is fine. No mods. No. No, I'm still here. The mods are going. <laughs> Spicy memes. Mods are gone up this picture of a duck. <laughs> Mods quick, post memes in general No Oh, jump, you're playing with the rules here I'm on my own stream Mods are gone Really brings out the color of the chat Oh god That's so scary You chat are a force to be reckoned with Fools, I haven't closed Twitch yet on my phone. Oh no. Look what you've done. Look what you've done. Look what you've done. <laughs> I do love my neighbors. Are they your favorite? F A V O R I T E is the proper way to spell favorite. Oh. Mods are here. Run, run. Mods are here. Run. Get away. Get away, get away. Get away, get away, get away now. <laughs> Don't mind me laughing at my own joke. Because I'm funny. Censorship. It's a good thing I'm wearing my spike silver proof armor. Ooh. Ooh. A worthy combatant to <laughs> to this tyranny. That one deserves to stay. It does. It does. It does. 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 K 
can pierce any armor. <laughs> the strongest force known to man. That's right, I have sheer audacity to put spicy memes in front of the mod. <laughs> now I am. Liban. Unlimited power! Yeah. <laughs> You guys, I figured out how to use the hospital rule. I had to use a derivative calculator, but I figured out how to use Leban Pitol. <laughs> oh my god. Hospital rule sucks. Me, yeah. Stinky hospital rule, but I figured it out. You forgot you were gonna sleep? The life of a mod leaves little room for sleep. Must be tough. Le hospital food sucks. Hey, not a bad lava lamp. Thank you so much. He's, he's vibing. He's a little dusty, but that's okay. Yeah, I do have a lava lamp. It's green and, and, and yellow. What other fun- I had a Charmander and he fell. Like, there's a gap here. He was on this little, uh, a, a tiny pot. He fell. Swarding the creep. <laughs> Thank you. His name is Dusty- Yeah! <laughs> I can name him Dusty. Here, wait. I have an expo marker. This might be a bad idea. But we can, um... Let me... We can- we can- we can give him a- Charmander didn't mind the gap, that's why we need- to... yes. Okay, let's... Oh, that color doesn't really show up now, does it? Uh... Maybe blue will? That color doesn't really show up either. I have a black expo marker somewhere. Oh my god. <laughs> the color. Let's try red. Red is like the opposite of blue. Oh, I took color theory. Dies in self cringe. I can. Oh my god. No, red shows up even worse. I was gonna draw a little face on our buddy. You know what, fuck it. I'll do it in Sharpie. Alright, I got a brown Sharpie. There we go. Color theory. Alright, there we go. Dusty the lava lamp now has a face. Which means he's capable of thought. If he's capable of emotion. He's gained sentience. Yeah, they do get hot. That's how they work. This might burn. Sentience achieved. Yes. Dusty has ascended. <laughs> Lava lamp. Sharpie ink isn't good to inhale, but do I care? I, d I don't think so. You know, I've, I, I oil paint in a, uh, wax moves up and down from convection, 30 watt bulb. Yep. Here, wait. I really shouldn't touch this while it's hot, but yeah, there's a bulb, like, right here, and there's probably a coil right there. But yeah. It's just wax in, like, special water. And I'm not worried about getting Sharpie, because let me show you a, a fun thing that you can... I bet you didn't know. Alright, I have a whiteboard here. That's true. Okay, so I've got, like, this whiteboard. Let me show you. I learned this on a TV show. Bottom at the glass lamp. Or Okay, yeah. So I've got a Sharpie. And I'll just 
right. Hi. And a smiley face. And you're like, oh no, you just rubbed Sharpie on this whiteboard. Oh, I watched that video too. There's this one guy on YouTube who does like medical stories. And he's so interesting. Because TV never lies. Yeah. And so, essentially, you, you if you write on Sharpie in a whiteboard, and then you cover it up with Expo Marker, like so. Yes, yes, that man. I love his videos so much. I watched the Silipac Silica Packet video not too long ago. You cover it up, and then it's like it was never there. And it's so cool. But, yeah, that's all. Showcase over. Back to calculus. I don't know if everyone knows that trick or not. <laughs> Cheating the system. Yeah, don't drink copious amounts of energy drinks. You will be able to see colors and feel your heart rate beat at an, ungod uh, an, an ungodly speed. Supersonic speed. All right, we've got to consider the integral. One to infinity. <laughs> I'm only hearing, hearing perks. Hmm, hmm, no. <laughs> Terrifying. E to the Rx over x. Where R is a big boy, constant, destroys kidneys, it do, rip nephrons. We just got that down the weird No! Oh god! Four pack of Red Bull. You know what I've heard is like drinking a Red Bull and like NyQuil at the same time is a uh, quite an experience. It's not good. You absolutely should not do that. <laughs> no. No. Your urine shouldn't ever be that clear. Show that the integral converges for an R greater than zero. Show all work and indicate any convergence tests used. Ugh. Disgusting. Don't bladder cancer. Oh, oh, stinky, gross. Yeah. We really talking about fun topics tonight, chat. Brain go brr. Yeah. You're right, you're right. At least it's not politics. That's true. That's true. Sometimes on painting streams, I'll be in VC with like a few other people, and they'll talk about the economy. We've managed to keep Spike Software away for 10 additional minutes. Let's go for 15. Yes. Yes. This stream is no longer about math. It's about destroying Spike's sleep schedule. Yes. Let's go for 15. Let's all work together. We can if we try. E to the Rx over x is greater than or equal to E to the Rx, given that x is greater than or equal to 1. Broken sleep schedule, gang, of course. Always, always, always. Came for math. Stayed for the spicy meme of preventing spice. Ban me. Ban me. Ban me, senpai. And that dude, then you hold the honor of being the first person ever banned.
I would be upset. You're vibing with us. That dude. And I appreciate the vibe. I don't like voices. Wait, does that mean I have a speedrunning world record? Yes! Number one? Yes, you would be. In all technicality. I mean, you keep talking like that, I'm gonna have to take you. Oh my god. Oh my god. I wish you could see the disappointment on my face. Yes, I am equally as uncomfy. Oh god. Dude, PDF broke. I don't need to because I can't. Bet it might be overrated, but it is also important. My computer blue screen. Oh no! Stop! I did not just need to read that sentence with my own two eyeballs. Absolutely cursed, Spike. Absolutely cursed. I'm so glad that you and that dude are well acquainted, though. Plus not equals meme. Yeah. That's me thinking about math right now. Ba -da 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 That's me pretending to be an instrument. Without the S. A Spain. She believed without the he lied. A sabiv, a sabiv. Sabiv, a sabiv. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> We're at the no brain hours, man. I might get some cheese. I got cheese sticks I could eat. No brain hours is all hours. That's fair. <laughs> no brain, just thoughts. To cheese or not to cheese? That is the question. I'm trying to think if I should, like, get an incentive to cheese or not cheese. I don't know. What do y'all think? Should I eat four cheese sticks in, like, three minutes? They're cheddar cheese sticks, if that helps. Hmm. I like the comic Lost, too. Consume. Hmm. Is it cheese time, boys? Shall I- shall I grab the cheddar? I can make a poll. Can't you just slash poll? Wait.
All right, chat. You've got one minute to decide. Cheese. Cheese hours. Cheese hours. It might be cheese time. It might be cheese time. We will learn in a minute if it is. La tiempo de queso. <laughs> El tiempo de queso. Wrong verb. Er, wrong. Wrong ending. No, what. What part of speech is like the? Oh, that was a fun sound. Bing! What? We need a lost emote? What do you mean by that? Like, just like me, like... No one has... No one has used what thing? Oh. That's okay. Alright, boys, it's cheese time. I'll be back. One second. It's cheese time. Cheese time? Let me... Usar mi refrigerador. Something else besides cheese. Alright, chat. I shouldn't give Spanish out for free. That implies that Spanish is not free. Alright, boys, I've got lemonade and count them. Four Cracker Barrel cheddar cheese sticks. Hell yeah. Spanish is not free. Duolingo begs to differ. Alright. We're putting math away for a minute. To consume Cracker Barrel cheddar cheese. <laughs> okay, but look at how these cheese sticks open. There's like a tear here. Right here. And then they expect you... To just go like that and eat the cheese like like this who consumes cheese sticks like that barbaric cheese is so good James May cheese <laughs> yes Mmm, delicious. <laughs> it's time to ramp up the memes. It is. What kind of music should we play? Well, I eat cheese. I have an idea. Y'all are gonna hate me, though. Inside joke. That's a unit ramp function. Blah. Unit ramp function. I didn't even know that was a thing. That scares me. You're actually falling asleep. That's kind of cool. Sleep is epic. That means your melatonin is working. Good night, Spike. Hi, actually, I'm falling asleep. Hi, leaving. All right, boys, I got the perfect cheese music. This exudes cheese energy, doesn't it? <laughs> Good morning. Sounds good, Spike. You can DM me on Discord. Mmm, cheese music. If 
anyone has any better suggestions to fit the cheese mood, please tell me. <laughs> yes. Ignore calculus, consume cheddar. <laughs> it's just a cheese and lemonade kind of day, boys. Doom soundtrack! Ooh. That is not a bad idea. Calculate the integral from bottom to top of cheese as cheese approaches consume. <laughs> that sentence makes me physically convulse. I will not calculate the integral of cheese, thank you. <laughs> BFG division. <laughs> mm -hmm. Look, I'm holding it like a cigarette. Cheese with respect to cheese. Delta cheese? <laughs> Upper limit cheese. <laughs> Which is zero, yeah. Homies eating cheese. <laughs> I see the cheese video. Yeah. We must calculate the work done to uh, lift a single bottle of lemonade. I could power play, make coffee right now. And then you get to see Maddie on espresso. But Maddie on espresso, the rate in which she does mathematics dramatically increases by like seven. Lemonade, yes, it's very good. It's tiny, unit sized. Oh, coffee. Hell yeah. Get that coffee. Small lemonade, yeah. Little buddy. Not sponsored. Of this coffee. How big? Give it to me in uh, metric tons. Mm -mm, kilograms, sorry. time. Enjoy your time watching anime. Carry the two. Drop the three. Okay, it's approximately something. Valid answer. Have fun watching anime, Blue. Final cheese stick. 
final cheese stick. Delicious. I'm still thinking about the food I had from the dining hall. It was very good. Dining hall food is seldom good, but when it's good, you remember when it's good. It's the final cheese stick. I'm trying to do it. Salad for the pun. Don't know why. I just got fun. That's a power play right there. Final bite. Four cheese sticks consumed. I am now out of cheese and incredibly disappointed. Also, you saw my glasses. Look at these bad boys. They help me see. How far would you go with a salad to get TOS for him? How far can a salad even... What a thought-provoking question. All right, no more cheese music. Back to grooving. An interesting quandary though. Like, you could make everything like, sh phallically shaped perhaps. Like, get like a cookie cutter or something and just slice all the tomatoes into that. Like, obviously, you could get TOS for nudity, so, like, you could just make the salad while nude. <laughs> In theory. Hmm. Okay, back to math. That cheese break was nice. What do they mean by exponential decay test? Is it supposed to? Probably dip. Yeah, that's fine. Thank you for tuning in. It was such a blast and it's been a blast. I'm gonna end the stream at one, so I only have about 20 more minutes, but uh, you get back to work and let's all be productive. Enjoy what I hope is Monday for you. Of course. Thank you for listening to this PSA. Of course. Thank you for providing it.
What is the exponential decay rule? I am unsure. I had to open up the textbook. That's how you know I'm actually trying. It's a big ol' yikes. What's epic is I have all of Monday to study too, because the test is until 8, so even though I'm like semi-struggling, it's not too bad. I understand most of the concepts, it's, it's how the concepts are applied that I don't understand, which is bad, because that's like half a test right there, but that's fine. That's fine, I'm vibing. We're having a good time. Dusty's here. I'm hoping this coming week, too, I'll be able to make a stream starting soon screen and a better BRB screen, because right now it's just the dogs. Um, which is fine. I don't mind them. They're cool. But I need something, something else. Don't mind me. I am looking for something in my textbook right now. Lots of mousy scrolling. Hmm. Geometric ratio series. No. Limit comparison. Comparison. I need exponential decay. Because apparently that's a rule. Um, P series integral. <laughs> okay, I have gone too far ahead. So, the rule exists, however, where does it exist? That is the question. Tests for convergent comparison, limit comparison. Ratio, alternating series, uh -huh. error bounds for an alternating series, don't know what that means, absolutely convergent, and that goes into problems, so what's the exponential decay, and how does that relate to convergence? Power series and inter interval of convergence. I don't think we've done that yet. <laughs> no sé que yo haciendo. When R, oh, when R is less than zero, it converges by the exponential decay test. Oh, wow, I'm a dumbass. Yeah, of course. Anything with exponential decay is gonna converge because it's just gonna approach zero. I didn't read all the, the lyrics. God, I really can't think. 
It really is the brains, the brainless hours. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay, back to math. Back to math, boys. So we know it converges. They also said by the direct comparison test. What are you comparing it to? Oh, b because you're comparing it to this. Which we know is going to converge because e to the rx, given that r is a value less than zero, means that this number is always, always, always going to be like less than less than zero a decimal a negative decimal specifically because exponential decay is when it's to a negative right right oh heavens i wish i paid more attention in algebra But no, I chose to play Tetris during class instead. It's fine. Alright, now we've got to prove. I'm gonna move these out of there. Look at this little buddy! Haha, <laughs> hello! Okay. We must prove that when r is greater than or equal to zero, it diverges one negative infinity, or one positive infinity. Uh, e r x over x. When it's positive and it's greater than one, this number is going to approach infinity. Well, we can compare it to uh, 1 over infinity. So, e r x over x is always going to be greater than or equal to, or equal to, because we don't know, 1 over x. Um, it diverges by the p-test. By the p-test, because p equals one. p is the exponent right here. It's one. So, by comparison, this bad boy, ERX to the X, also diverges. Which is uh, not very pog champ because it makes my job harder as a mathematician, but uh, that's okay. Me and my homies hate integrals. I don't know if there's a latency between me tapping and the music. I hope not. It'd be kind of funny if there was. Why is she drumming off beat? Oh, spicy. Had trouble paying his rent, so he started a cult. Oh god. This is that's the setup to the math problem. Late Vloss had trouble paying his rent, so he started a cult. His followers believe that Late receives holy messages from the Great Consciousness. This is literally a math problem. My university has given us hiding in the internet. Each month, Late recruits D new followers and loses twenty percent of his other followers. He had the previous month. Wow, it's like Twitch. To disillusionment and other cults. Oh my 
god, this is not a mouth problem. Oh, this laughter doesn't make it any better. Oh god. That is. After n months is described in the recursive formula d plus 0.5 f n minus 1. Suppose that Light has zero followers the moment he gets an idea to start a cult. Of course he would. He's delusional. Just say, f sub zero is equal to zero. Compute the number of followers he has in the first three terms. Okay, this is easy. This is like the geometric stuff. So f sub zero is zero, because he's got no followers. f sub one is d, the initial amount of followers he has. So then, for f sub 2, it's the initial amount plus 0.8 of the original amount, because 80% is lost. Or, 20% is lost, so 80% is preserved. And he still gains the same amount of followers. f sub 3 is just d plus 0.8d plus 0.8 squared d. Pretty fancy. This is a geometric series. That's cool. We know about those. We know about those. It's just 1 times the ratio 1 minus the ratio to the nth power over 1 minus the ratio. And that would be finding the nth term. Because it's a finite geometric series. I want to make sure I have notes on this. I'm like... 85% sure I do, but I cannot remember. So for finite, it's um, 1 minus ratio to the n over 1 minus ratio. For infinite, it's 1, it's initial times 1 minus ratio to the n plus 1 over 1 minus ratio. Pog. Pog. How do we know if it's infinite or not infinite? That's the real question. I guess it's just implied in the wording. Okay, to ensure Mr. Man can make rent each month, he needs a thousand followers to attend his cult. Why? This is such a weird setup for a question. The fewest number of followers, D, that Lay needs to recruit each month so he can pay rent. So the limit as n approaches infinity, f sub n, has to be greater than or equal to a thousand. Okay, limit n approaches infinity. Initial one minus point eight N over point eight 
And as n approaches infinity, this number is just going to be as close to zero as it possibly can without actually being zero. So this is really just uh, 1 over 0.2 times d. So in turn, this is just d over 0.2 is greater than or equal to a thousand point two times a thousand d is greater than or equal to 200 initial followers that's on math all right we've got two more problems in this practice exam and then i will end the stream boys I'll do. A, I'll watch a few more like educational YouTube videos, I think, and then I'll call it an evening. But I'm gonna watch the YouTube on my own time. I won't bore you with Maddie reacts. That's not fun. I do like math, though. This has been. This is an interesting format of a stream. It really does push the the boundaries of what's possible. What kind of math we doing? Over to we are doing calculus two. It is lots of improper integrals, convergence and divergence, um, geometric series, and uh, sums of sequences. Lots of fun stuff, if you tell me. I wish it was algebra or even trigonometry. However, it is not. <laughs> And I am suffering. Cumulative distribution function. Hell yeah. Oh yeah, distribution functions are on here too. And the median value of x. Median. <laughs> Speechless for a second, my bad. <laughs> Did my math catch you off guard? That's the experience, let me tell ya. My high school freshman brain cannot comprehend. Oh, that's so valid. That's so valid. It's, it's not fun. I, as a college freshman, it's not fun. College math hits different, dear friend. <laughs> but it's okay. We don't have to talk math either. I wanted to come back to delay you just for an extra minute. Oh, well, you read this message so you don't know streaming exactly at oh. 1k things by color! <laughs> Thank you so much, Pog. No, I won't end stream. I've got two more questions to do, so I'll just work through those two questions and then end stream, I think. For the sake of my well being. <laughs> Oh, holy guacamole. Thank you so much for the follow, Aruta. I promise you I don't only stream math. This is just temporary because I have an exam in uh, T minus uh, 17 hours? No. 12 hours. 1 to 2, 2 to 3, 3 to 4, 4 to 5, 5 to 6, 6 to 7, 7 to 8. 12 plus 7. 19. T minus 19 hours. Yeah, just expect M tier streaming. That's exactly true. M tier, my name is Maddie. It plays off that. But, uh. <laughs> mm. 
Yeah, I don't only stream maths. It's just a special occasion. I'll watch any math stream. They're low-key interesting considering... I don't know a fucking thing. Oh my god. How genuine. Yeah, I mean, I can try to explain it, but buddy, I don't know what I'm doing either. Why do you think I'm studying at one in the morning? I can tell you. Q of X, when it's the cumulative distribution function, CDF, big boy. The CDF is the antiderivative of the PDF. And I'm not talking about documents. Ha. Ha. <laughs> I love math. I'm kidding. I'd hate this. <laughs> If you listen closely, you can hear the pain in my voice. <laughs> this sounds like the Jackbox music. Yeah. What's up, gamers? What's up, gamers? <laughs> God, that God took me fucking shell shot. What's up, gamers? <laughs> I'm just trying to listen to some tunes. And they said no. Set up, but do not evaluate. An expression involving one or more integrals that represents the mean value of x. Oh, that's easy. The mean of a probability distribution function is just the integral. What's up, gamers? <laughs> exactly. is zero to infinity, and then you do the PDF, but then you add an extra variable in there, make it spicy. Cause that's how it works. Why? I don't know, they didn't explain it in class. I just kinda nod, and then, yeah, calculus. You'd think high school, you'd know what you're... That's true. I graduated high school very on the fence about what I wanted to be. And to be fair, I'm still on the fence about that. You, you... I think especially in the American education system, there's such an emphasis on independence at 18. And I don't agree with that because, like... <laughs> Yeah, you might be 18 and you graduated high school, that's cool, but, like, you still don't know a lot. I went into high school wanting to go into graphic design or video game design, and here I am in college studying biomedical engineering. So it's kind of crazy <laughs> how, how much your career path can change in high school. But that's just it's just something that happens. I'm not. I'm not. It's I. I sound like I am, but I. I promise you, I am. I I <laughs> I'm not that smart. Well, I take that back. I I've I've I'm not smart, but I put in the effort to understand things. And so, yeah. But I don't I don't consider myself 
It's fine. I do have a scholarship, but I worked for it. It's not something that happens overnight. You can literally do anything if you, like, put forth the effort. And it's kind of crazy. Like, people say that all the time, and you're like, really? But then if you, like, legitimately do, it, like, works. And it's so weird. <laughs> Uh, okay. Limit of Q X equals B equals one because that's the whole bad boy thing. The area under the curve it has to equal a hundred percent. Q two equals one half because it's the the median. So then one minus I can't write. 1 minus e to the 2c equals 1 half. Let's solve for c. Uh, add 1 to both sides. No, subtract 1 from both sides. Because it's positive right now. We have negative e to the 2c is equal to negative 1 half. The negative cancels out, so you've got 1 uh, Yeah, 1 half is equal to... The answer might be 4. We don't know yet. I think I agree. <laughs> Equals 1 half. And then since it's to the e, e to a power, you take the natural log of both sides and that gets rid of the e. Are you about to give 5 hours of homework stream? Hell yeah we are. Maybe I'll just stop it at the five. It depends how long it takes me to get through these last two questions. I'm already on part C of the second to last question. I know, I can't believe I've been doing math for f five hours. I don't know if I like that. I will say it's been a very productive stream. Because I have a whole Twitch chat to hold me accountable for actually studying. I, like, can't go off and watch YouTube because copyright. So I just gotta sit here and do math. It's such a weirdly motivating thing. Homework streams once a week? Hmm? I already kind of do that with the painting, but this is different. Oh, natural log of both sides. So this... Negative 2c, I forgot that there was a negative there, is equal to the natural log 1 half, hell yeah, divided by negative 2. c is equal to the natural log of 1 half over negative 2. It's kind of like 4. It has 2s in it. Four is made up of twos. Alrighty, lads, we've got one more question, and it's on convergent and divergent integrals, given that they're improper. Because you can't actually completely solve an improper integral, you can only get really, really close to solving it. Which is big stinky. One question left, yes. And then I will be free from the hell that is calculus. All right, so in problem 11, we're given two facts, two facts. One, that the integral from one to infinity of f of x dx converges. That's pog. And two, zero, 
less than or equal to g of x, which is less than or equal to 9 for all real numbers. So now we gotta figure out if the integral from this to this of one of f of x is convergent or divergent. It's a positive continuous decreasing function. Am I blowing your mind? Well, I can quick explain. Do you know what an integral is? Shall I give you a, a quick calculus lesson? So then you can at least know what I mean when I say integral. It's really easy to explain. Like, it sounds fancy and it looks fancy because you use, like, that symbol. But, um, it's not too crazy. Bum, bum, bum. We know it's decreasing, so this value, up to you. All right, I'll explain what an integral is. Wait, let Professor, let Professor Maddie get her whiteboard out. Boys, it's whiteboard time. Don't want to hold you up on your mat. Listen, man. I think at the end of the day, if I can explain it to someone else, that means I've got a good understanding of it. But, uh, hello chat. Welcome to Math Lessons with Maddie. Today we're going to learn about derivatives and integrals. Yes, math lesson time. Math lesson time. Let me close this so it shows up on stream. This is my whiteboard. It's cute, isn't it? It's bent. It's got a nice dent in it. Okay. And I'll even use whiteboard markers like, like your teachers at school. Ha ha ha. All right. So to know what an integral is, yes, I spell it with a Y. <laughs> no worries. Okay, so to first know what an integral is, we've got to learn about what a derivative is. So like, let's talk about everyone's favorite equation, the parabola, because it's the best way to give a, give a um, general Thing. So, like, the general equation for a parabola we know is y equals x squared. That's pog. Okay. And if I tell you we want to know the derivative of a parabola, you'd be like, well, what the heck's a derivative? A derivative is just a fancy way of saying slope. So, to find the derivative of uh, a parabola... We see that it has an exponent, and just for the sake of clarity, I'll also give it a constant in front of it. So the equation for this parabola is 5 times x squared. And if I told you, let's find the derivative, or the slope of this parabola over the value x, or for the value x, where you'd plug in an x value, and it would give you the slope at that exact point, a point tangent to point x on the parabola, we take the derivative. And so to do that, we first take the exponent and we multiply it by the constant in front of the x. So we get 10. And then you subtract 1. So the derivative of 5 times x squared is just 10x. So to find the slope of a point tangent to the parabola, meaning it just touches but doesn't go through any other points on the parabola, you would use the equation y equals 10x. So now, let me explain integrals, because they're way more fascinating, I think, than derivatives. But to understand integrals, we have to understand derivatives, because they're directly related to one another. An integral is a fancy way of saying area. So I'll just use good old reliable parabola again, but this time he's upside down. So we've got sur parabola here, 
And we'll say his equation is like negative 2x. Negative 2x squared. Pog. And I told you I want to find the integral of negative 2x squared from, I don't know, negative 4 right here and 4 right here. Integral is just a fancy way of saying area. So that's pretty much me asking you to find the area. Raises your hand. What's up? How can I help you? Professor Maddie. Yes, you can use the restroom. <laughs> You're still confused. Listen, man. You just gotta gotta accept it. Roll with the punches. Okay, so if we were gonna take the integral, it'd be the area under this parabola from the x-axis. So it'd be... Oh, this marker doesn't even write. That's disappointing. I got a marker. It'd be the area under the parabola like that. And so to do that, we take the antiderivative. So, I just taught you how to take a derivative, and now we've got to learn how to undo a derivative. So, uh, I'm still kind of bad at this because I'm still learning it, but... This is what online school is like. At least we're not on Zoom, boys. So, really, you'd add one to this. I think you'd divide by th three? Yeah. So this is negative two thirds. X to the third is the antiderivative. So... <laughs> we're on Twitch. Professor Maddie, I'll make a second Twitch channel where all I do is teach kids mathematics. The area under this parabola is given by the integral from negative 4 to 4. We got those from this. Of the antiderivative. And so then to calculate this integral, we take the derivative, which we already have. And it'd be 2x to the negative 4 squared minus negative 2 4 squared. There you go. Professor Maddie M2 teaching. <laughs> Hell yeah. Okay. But we know what negative 4 squared is. So it's just negative 2 times 16 minus a negative 2 times 16. Does it just equal 0? Leaves class. <laughs> I think I just fucked this up and taught you guys how to calculate integrals wrong. That's on M tier teaching. Remember, I'm a gamer, not a teacher. <laughs> Wait, let me do this on my calculator. Chat, school will say you can't use a calculator. Don't listen to school. Minus a negative. Yeah, it just equals zero. And there's no way that equals zero. So I did something wrong, but, uh, yeah. Just look it up on Khan Academy, boys. I think it's because this needs to be... It's just from zero to four doubled. I think. Wait. Unless it's... Oh, wait. I fucked up. <laughs> I'm so glad I remind you of your grade 9 math teacher. Lesson over. Maddie's done correcting herself. Sal Khan Academy can t teach you. I doubt you'll need to care about derivatives anytime soon, though. Unless you nerds are gonna take calc in high school. I am not 40, I promise you. Name any 40-year-old that plays Minecraft. Unironically. And knows how to work Discord. I've never met a 40-year-old that knows how to work Discord. Correction, I've never met a 40-year-old. 
with the exception of like my family. We're just going on all kinds of tangents tonight, boys. I have not learned a single thing. <laughs> this diverges though, because it's decreasing, so it's just gonna approach zero. And 1 over 0 doesn't exist. Y'all know that dividing by 0 breaks your calculator, right? It's beyond human comprehension. And there's a paradox associated with that. You can never completely break something into nothing. And isn't that a terrifying thought? I usually watch Apex streams so I can make conversation, but this is fucking crazy. I know, it's it's definitely not Apex Legends. It's definitely not Apex Legends. Hits different after 1.30 p.m., boys. F to the N. Bum, 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 bum. I think it doesn't help that I've been, like, going strong for five hours now, doing math. <laughs> I'm, I'm going a little nuts. The numbers, they're speaking to me. It's a positive continuous decreasing function, so if it's, like, 1 over 1, plus 1 over 2, plus 1 over... Th like, that's eventually going to converge to 2. It'll approach a sum. So it converges. Five hours of anime. Yeah. Five, I wish five hours of anime, but yeah, five hours of math with some anime sprinkled in. I had one of my bandmates join the stream earlier. That was funny. And I didn't realize it was him until I looked at this Discord username. Oh, I felt so bad. I felt so bad. What the fuck? You have to be up in five hours. Or it, oh God. I wake up at 8, so I have to be up in 6 hours. I'll probably, like I said earlier, watch like a couple of YouTube videos on this stuff I don't understand. And then go to bed. And then start my work week. I'm excited. Well, I don't work. I have like a part-time job. And I do Twitch. Those are my only jobs currently. But it's it's pretty epic. All right, eleven C is the integral from one to infinity of f of x times. I should make it an actual time symbol times g of x dx and we know this converges because f of x converges and g of x is just um a constant you're hungry oh dude that's awful i threw down uh four cheese sticks about an hour ago so i'm doing good i had cheese sticks and the lemonade and i've been periodically drinking water that's epic. Yeah, so we know this converges because it's just number times other number is going to approach another number. We don't know anything about the function itself. Oh no, it's positive and decreasing. So it's also going to decrease. So they're just going to work together and give us a value that I'm assuming approaches, but we'll never, yeah. It'll start at nine. 
and go down to zero. So it converges. Go for a sub. Hmm. You know, I could too. I don't know if we're talking about the same kind of subs, but uh, I think both, both are good. I like how I point at my computer. I really should point up to the, the camera, but mm -mm, chat is here for me, not there. Oh, whoopsie. All right, 11D. The sum, that's the sigma symbol. It just means sum of the bounds are one and infinity. But in calculus, infinity is just a concept. It is not a number. I'm talking about my sexy sandwich, hell yeah. Dude, sandwiches are so good. This is pretty much just saying a number that's almost zero. Or no, this converges to a specific value. So a specific value And another specific value. Wait. Because the answer is cannot be determined. You cannot determine the, su the sum of f of n to the g of n. Hmm. Oh my gosh. Okay, one more question, chat. One more question, and then I will be free from this practice math exam that I've been taking for the last five hours. Whilst also, you, you know, distracting myself. <laughs> um, okay. It's the integral. One... g of x dx. What do we know about g of x? We know it's a positive, continuous, decreasing function. And that g of x is somewhere between the value of 0 and 9, given that x is a real number. Hmm. And we want to find the integral... Whether or not it converges or diverges. We can't really know, though, if it does because we don't know the actual function. Do we? We only know parts of it. Hmm. Why, though? Hmm. g of x dx from 1 to infinity well I guess we don't know I guess for sure if g of x approaches 0 or if it starts at 0 because it could just like approach any number at all and we're never told if it converges for sure so we just know it's it's bounded. And bounded does not exactly mean convergence. Only if it's monotone and convergent. Or monotone and bounded. I forget what it means when it's monotone, though. 
One sec, I'm looking at my notes. Now that might be a completely different concept. What's my favorite drink? Ooh, good question. I like either root beer or lemonade are my go-to. And of course, like, I drink a lot of water. But either root beer or lemonade? Why, what's yours? Also, this song slaps. What is it called? Oh gosh, they put all the timestamps in the description. This is a good one. I'm turning it up for you guys. Lemonade hits different. Yes. Yeah, I drink mostly water these days too. It's healthy. I did actually skip another question, so we'll have to go back and do that. I'm trying to think of your favorite drink. Hmm, big think, big think. Bum, 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 bum. Okay, okay, okay. Come. Yeah, it's a good thing to like water. It's a good thing to like water. I drink a lot of coffee, too. But that's just the college student life at this point. I'm just bopping to this music. I'm sorry. I'm having a good old time. <laughs> Is it going to hit us with another what's up, gamers? <laughs> I'd cry. Yeah, lemonade. Lemonade. Lemonade's so good. Alright, now that that song is done, I'll turn it down a little bit more. We were grooving, though, for a minute. Alright, I gotta go back to the question I skipped. Whoopsie. Okay. It's the median value of x. This stinky thing. No me gusta. P X equals point one. Nope, wrong numbers. Point oh six. X plus two. Plus point three. That's already given to us. I think I just need to set it equal to one half and solve for X. I don't think it's that easy. But it might be. Let me check. I will cry if it is. I will cry. Oh, you don't have a favorite food? I'll tell you. I mean. Uh, my favorite food changes like every month. I think in terms of like snack food. I think popcorn's just a good go-to for me. I absolutely love popcorn. Uh, pasta. Mashed potatoes, tomato soup, uh, waffles, obviously, it's in the name. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Do you have a favorite, like, type of food? 
Cheese. Cheese too. Cheddar cheese, specifically. I did just eat four cheese sticks. I had four. I do. I like all food too. I'm a little picky. I don't like ketchup. But that's like the only. That's not a food. That's like an access. A food accessory. You literally only set this equal to one half and solve for x. It's that easy, and I kind of love that. No, I don't put any sauce on my burgers. I have a, a literal cheeseburger. Healthy, not healthy. Yeah, yeah, I agree, I agree. I had spinach with my uh, dinner tonight. I love spinach, though. Spinach is so good. And kale? Kale slaps. Call me a vegan, or whatever. Kale is so good, and you cannot change my mind. I like carrots. Pretty much anything. <laughs> I think. Uh, yeah, you set it equal to 0.5. Add 0.3. No, subtract 0.3 from both sides. Wow, I've... spinach is pretty good. Yeah. So 0.06x plus 2 is equal to 0.2. Divide by 0.06. Chat, I don't know how to divide decimals. So I'm going to use my calculator for the saddest division problem ever. 0.2 divided by 0.06 gives me a not happy fraction. I like crunch ice. You just eat ice jump. This is 10 thirds. Grapes smack. Yes, they do. Okay, purple pur or like red grapes or green grapes? That's the real question because I like... I prefer green grapes to red grapes. X plus 2 is equal to 10 over 3. Subtract 2. X equals 10 over 3 minus 6 over 3. X is equal to 4 thirds. Problem solved. Hi, Gumi. How are you doing? You're on your phone. That's cool. Well, chat, I finished my math practice exam. Do we have any parting questions? I meant lettuce. Not sure. But sure, ice. Yeah. Ice is good. Lettuce is good, too. Red? Really? That's interesting. They're sweeter, I think. Green grapes are a little tart. You have big delay. Uh-oh. That's just because mobile's stinky. Unless it's a big delay for everyone. I don't know. You computer users. What are your thoughts? Mobile Twitch is ass. Yeah, it is. But, chat. I'm done with my math practice exam. I'll stick around for, like, 15 more minutes. If anyone has any other parting questions... Perhaps it's a Wi-Fi problem, then? I'm not sure. I could draw something really quick. Let me grab my sketchbook. We'll draw for a minute. I'm not changing category, because it's literally just going to be a quick little 15-minute doodle. Brain break. Brain break. Brain break. I have my sketchbook here. I see all these stickers. They're from um, my last year of high school. I took pre-calculus, and my teacher put a sticker on the test. Everyone, every time someone got above a ninety percent. So uh, not to flex, but I was good at pre-calculus. But that's not what we're here to do today. I'm gonna draw. Let me show you. I can draw, boys. I draw all the time. See, look, I design characters. Besides just doing math, I I do more than math. Sometimes. Oh, I drew Rock Lee from uh, Naruto. Haha. <laughs> We're not here to go through Maddie's sketchbook, though. We're here to draw something. Look 
Look at this cute farmer boy. Maybe I'll draw him. He's fun. I haven't drawn him in a minute. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. <laughs> this pencil is covered in oil paint from uh, my last project. Oh, look at it. It's so gross and just covered in paint. <laughs> Whoopsie. It's been a minute since I've drawn uh, in my cartoon style. I think it's probably changed because I use a completely different style uh, for my emotes than I do like just drawing people normally. Which is usually how it goes. But yeah, I'll do a quick little doodle and then I'll sign off for the night. Because it is late. You can't really see it that well. And I'm left-handed, so my hand blocks it, like, half the time. But that's a Maddie problem. Bro. Is a desktop audio just... stopped working? Hmm? Okay. Let me turn it up because I don't think you guys can hear it that well. It's definitely showing up. Like I can see the little audio thing right there. It's that one. This one's my voice. I don't know if you can see it when I talk. You can kind of. Ooh. That drop was spicy. It's uneven, but I don't really care. I'm just ready to take my math exam, boys. Oh. This has been really fun. It's, it's a little different from what I usually do. But I've really enjoyed it. Like I said, there's a sense of ac accountability there with, um, with this. It's obviously not, like, the most entertaining, but I think it, it paves way for accountability and, uh, interaction. My man just needs a t-shirt. Some overalls, because he's a farmer. And that's how you know he's a farmer. He wears overalls. do that hair originally that's here look at it it's so tricky if you've seen Haikyuu he reminds me of Hinata from Haikyuu Walmart Hinata Bustin Bustin hell yeah oh hell yeah hell yeah we Ghostbusters You can't see, but I'm grooving.
Is hat so funny? Silly hat boy. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> what kind of... Um... Math brain rot do I need? You're just spamming emotes? Hell yeah, go off. Someone gave you- Oh, Discord Nitro- In the Discord? Good job. Discord Nitro Pog. Yeah, Nitro Pog. I'll give him a different expression. <laughs> Cow. Moo. Don't really know how to draw. I'm so glad we can vibe to the this remix of the Ghostbusters theme together. I said that already, but I, I'm really enjoying it. It's an experience and a half, man. Look at the surprised lad. He needs more defined eyelids. Very pog, thank you. Yeah. And the eyebrows. They're uneven. Like I said, this is zero brain cell hours. We don't think right now. We just... We just do. Okay. And you do this. And I've got one piece of hair in the front here. I think the one thing consistently about like my different styles is always the way I draw hair. It never changes. I'm too scared to change it. Oh, you know what? We should end with the Minecraft music. What's the like main one? God. Minecraft music? We should end with Minecraft music. I'd love that. It's not DMCA, is it? Because, like, this song vaguely reminds me of it. You know what I mean. Like, that, like, piano bit. Like, if you sat there and you wait for a minute. What? What about Wet Hands? Is that the name of the song? It is. I didn't know that was the name of the song. <laughs> it's like a little bit into the song though. Dun, dun, dun. Dude, at sub goal, I'll learn this on the piano and we'll do a piano stream of only Minecraft music. Oh, it's so nice. Mm-hmm. 
25 cell. Yeah, I think that's reasonable. I have to update it because it didn't actually update during the stream. Because I, I think a few people renewed their sub. I don't know if I get sub tokens for renewed subs. I'd have to check. I don't know. Twitch is kind of stingy. I just want emote slots, man. I'm a simple woman with simple needs. Emote slots, please. He looks younger in the way I drew him. I just blame the fact that currently my style is like literally just how I draw my emotes. Epic. Well, guys, it's been a really fun night, but um, for as fun as it is, I do have to get up at least before nine o'clock tomorrow, and it's two in the morning, so uh, I have to end the stream here. We we drew for like a few minutes. Am I gonna go to bed? I've gotta watch a few YouTube videos to review some stuff, and then I'm going to go to bed. I shouldn't be up for more than 30 more minutes. So, I will sleep. But, everyone, it has been so much fun. Um, thank you all for, for tuning in and sticking around and just having a bunch of fun with me. This has been great, and I will see you all later. Good night, everyone. Bye-bye!